What is up, YouTube? This is another Cage 2 rando, but this time it's actually Boss Enemy rando on the PC version. For the first time ever. Um, let me make sure the tracker is working. Caution. There we go. Death Counter is back. I got a million Crimson Jazzes and Core as if that enemy as if that area need to be more annoying. Sounds cool. I have it set to um boss enemy or uh, yeah, the boss randomizer is set to what is the um what were the name of the options? There's like one to one, one to one to one per room and then like wild. I have bosses set to one to one, whatever the fuck that means. And um Enemies set to one to one per room. What does that mean specifically? I think that means that, like, the basic setting called one to one will just replace, like, oh yeah, across the whole game, shadows anywhere they spawn will be replaced with this enemy. So, like, it's not just like 100% random, which there is an option for. I have it set to one to one per room, so that'll be the case. So, like, say if shadows are, like, Crimson Jazzes in, like, specifically Beast Castle, like, the first room where you just have that shadow uh, horde fight. There could be another shadow horde fight in a different world that has, like, living bones, that big-ass fucking enemy. So, it's, like, one-to-one -one per room. That's what, it, that's what it means. Wild means bosses can be normal enemies? Okay, good thing I didn't use that one. <laughs> I didn't know they could do that. That's fucking awesome. Yeah, September this year sucks. I don't even know why they're pushing multi-month subbing. Like, who does that benefit? Exactly, I don't know. What do I need to have my own randomizer? You need to have the PC port. And install the mod. It's in the Discord of, um... Somebody link in the fucking... What is the Discord command? I already multi-month sub to you. See, they mean, like, in bulk, which is weird, because it doesn't even really save that much money. I think the multi-month thing only benefits Twitch, and, like, not even in a big way, because they're just, it's, like, the same amount of money. I don't know, it's fucking weird. September sucks, but if you are, uh, motivated to subscribe, then, um, yeah, go for it, whatever. I can just get the emulator question mark. That, that's another way of doing it, but that's old. You, your PC should be able to handle it. I want to say that, like, the PC port is just as, like, demanding on your computer as the as running the PS2 emulator for one of these games. YouTube VOD watcher, glad to be here? Hell yeah. I'm glad to hear that. I hear that all the time, actually. And I appreciate it all the same. Relaxed sham today? Am I not relaxed before? The Bariku, the Seeker of Twilight. I wonder what your favorite franchise is. I'm feeling good. I had a monster. Had some spubbies at Subway. I like to call it spubbies. Anyways. Let's get this shit started. Where's my timer? Okay, here we go. Uh, my timer is a little funky, so how do I run it? There we go. Let's do this. Okay, yeah, I also set it so that this seed as level 3 growth at the start instead of level 1 just because it's a fucking crazy ass seed. So I want to give myself a little stimmy. Kingdom keys. 3, 7, once more. Okay, thank god I have something like... Oh, look at my... Look at my DS4 acting up on me again. Do I really need to bust out the fucking... I think I do need to bust out the, um... The backup. This is my new fucking... DualSense... Dual, yeah, my DualSense 4. What the fuck? 
Why are they calling it a dual sense? This is my dual shock four that I got like two or three months ago that is like already on the fritz. Sucks ass. I hate Sony. Seven six damage control. Give me that. Once more is good, but it's like effectively useless this early on. Well, assuming you're getting one shot. In a rando context like this, it's just kind of... I'd rather have second chance. But who knows, this fucking... anything could happen. Yeah. Since last week I've been listening to a lot of Megaton music. Yeah. Goddamn enemy of God is so good for it is. SMT4A. Also, hey, another sub. Yo, Waterlord, with the 14 months, thank you very much. Yeah, SMT music is unfucking paralleled That's the whole reason I've been, like, using it in all my fucking videos for such a long time, is because it's such a good... ...roster of games and soundtracks to pull from. You need to manually track once more. Oh yeah, I do. Don't I? I'll put that on Garden. I don't think I'm doing a blackout seat, so that wouldn't matter, but I'll just do that just in case. Oh, let me turn off the fucking tiny sub icons on the tracker. I hate those fucking progress tracking. It's for fucking nerds who care about that kind of shit. How do I turn that stupid ass shit off? How do I turn that off? Simple progression icons? It doesn't let me turn it off. All I have is an option for simple progression icons and game progression icons, and it doesn't seem to do anything or turn it off. Get that shit out of here. Yo, how's it going? Oh, I see what it's doing. I see what it's doing. That fucking icon next to 100 Acre. Yo, King Tim with the 18. Thank you very much. Oh, toggles. Oh, there it is. Toggles, world progression icons. Turn that shit off. Why does... Roxas World have a plus next to it. How do I turn that off, too? It probably doesn't matter, but... Track ghost items? What the fuck is a ghost item? What are these new modes? No, whatever, this is good enough. Your streams convinced me to go buy SMT5 and Sulkers 2. Hell yeah, make sure Atlas knows who sent you. Alright, where are we going? Hey, Eternal, the gifted sub, thank you very much. Okay, right, we gotta get um, all our items. Did you install the SMT boss music mod? I haven't. Just because it would be really unfitting in a boss randomizer context. I'll have that set up, like, next time I do, like, a normal seed, but I don't know when that'll be. But I also would like you to make a couple changes to it. So I'll, I'll let you know the details of that in the future. Oh, let me move the tracker so that it's not, like, clipping with the, uh, the shop prompt. There we go. I forgot that it covers that at that distance. There we go. How were you introduced to Kingdom Hearts? I remember... Watching my brother play KH1 when I was like just forming memories. Like for the first time. Like at that age where you're like beginning to form some of your first memories, some of those were of KH1. And I was like, oh, that's pretty cool. The one I drank is giving me a headache. Was it dry or sweet? Yeah. I mean, the three bottles. How many of those bottles were dry and sweet, I guess? Full-bodied Merlot. Aren't you, aren't you proud of me that I said Merlot correctly? Yo, Infinite AJ, with the six months and the prime, thank you very much. Enjoy the emotes. Oh, look at these enemies. I just realized what I was doing. I just remembered it's fucking randomized. Not minute bombs anymore. 
Look at these fucking Tron Heartless in Disney Castle. Oh, these- I love these enemies. Check this out. These are my- like, some of my favorite enemies in the game, because you can do this. Oh, man. These enemies are, like, one of the few enemies in the game that will always do their reaction command attack if you hit them, like, one time. And sometimes... Sometimes when you do it on one enemy, it'll hit another enemy and, like, trigger it against so you, just like a mash triangle. There's no iframes in that RC? Wow, okay. That RC is fucking garbage. Never do it. What the fuck? That can happen. There are RCs without iframes. I had no idea. Anyways, that's a cool enemy. You don't see him very often. Usually, when you're actually like playing the normal game, that should like one-shot them with like RC boosts and good stats. So it's usually not an issue. My favorite part of Soul Packers Two was when Ringo said, "I guess they were Soul Packers Two." You know, she actually, she actually does. What the fuck has happened? Oh my god! Look at this! Holy shit! Oh my god! Look at this! Oh my fucking god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Wisdom grinding is gonna be so fucking based this seed. Look at this, dude. Look at this. Speaking of fucking reaction commands that are cool in this game, this is like the best one in the whole game. Wow. Okay. Well, I hope it stays like that and it doesn't like change after this. Let me save right. I'm gonna make a hard save just in case like the enemy changes. I don't think it will on these settings, but. Uh, save slot 69. Is it taken already? Oh yeah, these are my level 1 saves. Hooray! Let's use 33. Just in case progressing the world changes it. I have so many saves, it takes so long to fucking load. Anyways. When... There's a chance that when you use a revival bead as Ringo in Soul Hackers 2, um, she'll be like, Oh, Soul Hack! Yeah. Kinda. Like, that's what she says. My friend got me a little Jack Frost keychain. But did they get you a print club? They didn't. Everybody needs a print club. I recently learned about um, some Atlas lore, some Jack Frost lore. There's a there's an arcade machine thing in like Japanese arcades and malls and shit called Print Club, and it's like a fo it's a photo booth. It's a Japanese photo booth, but it's uh, made by Atlas and Sega, so it's got like all sorts of like Jack Frost stuff on it. Dude, I did not sign off on those up inputs. Okay, all right, this controller has to go. This controller has to go. Hold on. This fucking controller. It's like three months old. Alright, time for old reliable. DS4 with the monster sticker on it. So all I can do is not done yet. I'm like... I want to say I'm like three-fourths into that game, more or less. Let's see if I can do this without rebooting the game. I don't want to do that again. Thank god. This is my... DualShock 4 with a fucking... Uh, it has a D-pad that, like, has freedom of movement on it because I accidentally scratched away, like, I wish I had, hold on, let me plug in my webcam because this is a really funny thing I did, I think on stream, over the course of, like, several months, but I found out that I had a tick. Yeah, let me plug in my webcam. This is a really funny thing that happened over the course of, like, many months. Uh. 
the fuck? This is all reliable, right here. Look at the bottom. You see that indent on the bottom D-pad button? How do I how do I best show this off? Here we go. That is an indentation that I scratched. Oh, here we go. I scratched into the bottom of the stick by doing like this. Like in, in between cutscenes or like any downtime, I would like do what I'm doing with my thumb here. I would do that, and then a hole formed, and I was like, what the fuck? Why is my D pad so wobbly? And that's why. I don't know. And I realized it when that started to happen on another controller, like my, like a third fucking DualShock 4 that I had that had a shitty battery. And I was like, why is it so wobbly? It's because I was fucking scratching a hole into my controller. But this controller still works just fine, it's just a little wobbly. I don't know if the battery is all that good either, but it'll do. Yeah, that's all I was here for, for those chests. But now I have to do the fucking minigame. You can still get the Sega Print Club machines for $5,000? Oh, hell yeah. Yo, what's up, Corbin? Stimulus package! Somebody asked me what gaslighting in Stockholm Syndrome is. What kind of goofy objects did I have in my background today? Look at the name of this Moogle. Artemicon. Artemisio. What? What is this guy's name? Is that a Final Fantasy reference? Wow, they have it, motherfucking Newport. Oh yeah, my sheets are washing right now. That's why I've got a weird hearts. fucking thing in my bed. Is your king dumb? <laughs> wow, they have it. Because he doesn't have a heart to go on a run, sugar-free, to accelerate the healing of his biology while eating his own damaged flesh and blood to create the growth hormones that are required. To raise a I need to... dome so he can have wisdom. I need to overhaul the rewards. Oh my god! Oh motherfucking Newports. I keep forgetting that this is an enemy randomizer. I can go! I'm coping! Back! I can go! This is coping! Kingdom Hearts 2 has Oh my god, what's happening? Oh Imagine if I was one shotting them. That he said. Okay. Yeah. Oh my god, I just wanted the chests, man. There's no iframes. I think Coolsville sucks. Mm. Somebody asked me what gaslighting I'm not getting these chests, aren't I? Yeah, fuck these chests. I just have the bats. I, I, thankfully, I don't see the rewards on my game screen. If I did, I'd be fucked. But I do hear them. It is possible for me to full screen the stream preview so that I technically could have the rewards getting in my way. That'd be a nightmare. Where should I go? I guess I could do 100, um, 100 gex. I don't know why I wanted to say 100 acre wood when I was when I meant to say whatever the fuck this world is called Pride Rock. Pride Rock. Wow, dude, Pride Rock. Remember that clip I posted on 
Twitter like two years ago where I was like, I me at the start of every cage two rando seed. And it's the guy in the video saying that. Wow, dude, pride rock. I need to retweet that. I have two shock charms, what the fuck? Oh, oh this dragoons! I looked away and I did I I looked away and I was trying to do the fucking rodeo strat. It's look it's fucking dragoons, dude. It's randomized. Fuck. Oh my god. Can I kill them? I looked away, I was looking at chat, mashing triangle, and up left on my fucking stick. They're Dragoons! What's the EXP like? Yeah. It's gonna be scaled down, right? Yeah, relative to the real enemies in the real world. That's really cool this game does that. This game can scale enemies and the EXP they drop, like, to fit any world. I gotta look over my shoulder at these fucking randomized enemy spawns. Anything could happen like like that. Look at how many deaths are fucking on the tracker right now. Was that eight, nine? Yeah, eight. I didn't know if it's gonna go up or not, but. Dude, final form though! Good thing I pushed through and I got it. How do I not get killed by this fuck? Oh no. How do I. I wish I had magnet. Yeah, I need to try the new, um, the new systems. Dude, look at this fucking guy! And there's like two of them. Okay. That was... this move rips ass. We're gonna see so many rare reaction commands today, you guys don't even know. There's actually a reaction, one of the rare reaction commands is from that guy doing that attack, but you can't do it as line sore. But if you sidestep that attack, you get a really good RC. I can't fucking get him out. This is why I said second chance is better than once more, at least in Rando. Can I like go around and despawn them? I might be able to do that, just do it in a different order. Kinda works. Yeah, that works perfectly. I'll get killed. Nice. Oh, I added a couple new uh, 7 TV emotes. Make sure to get acquainted with the new 7 TV emotes. Juicing yet? In a couple of ways. It's a fun thing to look. What's this red stick next to my name? That is your sub badge. For being a loyal multi month subscriber. What's the status? The stats on Omega Weapon? Did I get that? Oh, yeah, I need a. I, I got it because of the final form. I'll check that when I leave this world. Enjoying my paid time off, hell yeah. I love paid time off. Blizzard element. My favorite one. Reflect element, that's my favorite one.
Twitch tr tried to gaslight me real fucking hard at the start of the stream. Did you guys notice when the, when the view count went from like 70 to 30 in like one second? The way Twitch reports view count is like so like weird and flimsy and fucked up that sometimes you get weird shit like that where it like goes back on itself. Or my favorite one is where, like, if your stream is, like, buffering and, like, restarting really hard because your internet's getting fucked up, the view count will, like, increase dramatically and then decrease dramatically because people are getting counted as, like, two viewers at the same time. And then it goes down because, you know, people naturally are like, oh, fuck, this stream's buffering. And it's like, you're, it's like Twitch is trying to fucking gaslight you. It's really weird. buffering as he's complaining about buffering that's your internet i have like all sorts of statistics i can look at to see if i've buffered and i haven't dropped a single frame your bum ass internet is worse than mine butto yeah, butto what? what is he saying oh i also have the um I also have the thing that lets me have Sora's move set as Roxas. I'll check that out later. Undubbed. Zero one finishing plus. Fuck. I said final form. I can go to TT one now. I'm actually really juiced. Look at my magic stat. 26 at level 10. That's higher than average. I have to redo this fucking menu again. Alright, what else do I normally do? Uh, Agraba, you can steal some of Aladdin's ethers and get like four more chests. No, you can't randomize the enemies. Did I say anything about grinding final forms? Oh man. Thanks for the fast shot to die there, but I wanted to get some kills there. I did mention. I mean, right, actually, I did mention. Oh, I final form, new TT1. Right, right, you're right. That is indeed what I did. Fuck. I'm owned, I guess. But there are, there are gonna be nobodies all over the place now, like, what just happened. The best gaslighters are people that forget what they said, like, four minutes ago. Because they, themselves, are gaslit. Try that cage three overhaul mod. Yeah, that one. Hmm. Oh, um, the reason why we didn't get the pure blood keyblade in that last seat is because I actually had it turned off because I thought it would crash the game. You don't sound happy about the overhaul mod? No, I actually don't know what the overhaul mod is, because there are like 17 of them now, right? Oh, that fucking enemy. Oh boy. Oh jeez. Oh fuck. It's funny to see enemies that spawn here that don't break the walls like they're supposed to. Who are those? Oh, they're all shamans! Oh, fuck. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Get up. Thank you, iframes. 
I'm gonna run out of drive if I keep this up. Get me the fuck out of get me out of here. No, I'm gonna run out. That fucking enemy. That's an enemy that you're like really mostly not meant to fight at all as base Sora, but then they invented the Cavern of Remembrance and they were like, yeah, let's um, put him in there. There is one... There is a single one and only counterplay strategy against them and it's kill them as soon as they spawn. That's the only thing you can do consistently to fuck them up. If you give them more than a second, to exist before they like as as they spawn, they will immediately go invulnerable and start like sending projectiles up your ass. It's really funny. So it's actually kind of cool because it encourages. It's like one of the only enemies in the game that encourages you to actually like memorize the spawn locations of enemy configurations. So, like, I think the only fight that they show up in in core is Heartless 1. I think it's like the third enemy wave, third and fourth enemy wave. One of them will show up in the back, and then one of them will show up on the side. Is that every chest? I don't think it is. The cars, that's like an old, that's old school, um... That's an old school filter enemy that filters out players that can't guard. That's an old school thing. The only thing that's annoying, the, I think genuinely the only thing that is annoying and like risky about the cars is the fact that they are invulnerable as they are, I think mostly invulnerable, as they're starting up the DM. That's the only thing that I look at those enemies and be like, oh yeah, they're kind of a pain. It's just that one moment where, like, they will parry you if you swing at them. And, like, they won't take any damage. I don't know if they take damage to stuff, but... Because the cars have an RC where you drive them to another enemy. That's... I think you're thinking of KH3. No, they don't. Why are they dropping so much money? You see this? Is this normal? That's... I feel like I'm getting a lot more money than I'm supposed to off of these drops. Maybe it's because I have like two jackpots on, right? Hold on. I have one jackpot on and that's... Yeah, I have two jackpots on. Goofy has one and I have one. Okay, money seed. That's cool. Look at these autos today. Fucking jackpots all over the place. I think Aladdin has one too, right? Are Aladdin's abilities active if he's in the back pocket like he is right now? Yeah. Allie just FaceTimes me at work like she doesn't have a whole ass job to be doing. That reminds me of, um... I've got a buddy who works at the same place, fucking CVS. When he, when he visited town recently, he went back to his old job and like... I was talking to his old co-workers. And... Like, just in the middle of the shift, they... Um... With whipped cream, they, like, pied the manager. Is a zip you can install an open cage that restores the world icons? Oh, I need to get that. Also, I just ran out of my drive. Oops. The good thing is I'm more or less used to what the worlds are with or without Goa icons. Where do I want to go today? I could probably do my uh, Port Royal funny business where I die a bunch of times. It's, I've got like more than enough magic for that. Let's do some early business and stuff. Yeah, and pages. Developer chat pinned. You'll find Goa icons as zip. Man, the fucking discordification of the internet. Why is there no, like, website that just has, like, all the cool, like, mod manager packs just in it? 
I have to go on a fucking Discord all the time for everything. I gotta go to the specific channel and the specific pins, and I scroll through the pins. I hate that shit. Nice wisdom form. Oh, I know exactly where I'm going with that. Unknown disc. I wonder what's on. Soul wing. Oh, there are nobody's all over the place here. I can farm their cum for final form. Check this shit out. Are they still gonna be here? They are. Oh, I have no fucking drive. Hold on. What should I do about that? I'll come back. Oh yeah, wisdom. What you don't drive for? I'll be able to get driving like a second here. Take this shit out. Alright, because they're all still here. Look at that drive bar. Reflect is gonna go crazy here too, check this out. Look at that. Look at look at the, look at the drive orbs because of fucking double jackpot. I love to see that. Fucking goofy. You don't need to be doing all that. Very good. I need to turn off Goofy's attacks. Hey, another reflect for my efforts. Very cool. Found out the actual reason why random devs couldn't have used the actual KH1 Ultima sound effects. Why? I'm curious. Are they like a different file format or something? There's no reason. Oh, tasteless. Is that the is that the reason? No taste. It's all the same file type. Did you manage to do it? Not yet, but I haven't extracted cage two yet. One. Oh, nice. Oh, whoa! Look at that! Look, whoa! What? That dude just came out of the fucking floor. He just crawled out of the floor. What the fuck? Oh, these guys are tripping out. These guys are normal enemies here. It must be one of those fights that I guess you can't randomize because of uh, reasons. Uh, CL, yeah, that was some SMT shit right there. What's up, day? Where are you? That's that boss with the N word attack, right? Yo, double sided Kai with a 20, thank you very much. Four will come out. Uh, 
Same as everyone else, I share the opinion that it'll come out, like, at the earliest, like, late 23 or late 24. Somewhere in between those two estimates. Sooner than most people would expect. At least compared to Cage 3. And what did you mean by N-word attack? You'd have to see the name of the spell he casts. Oh, he just... I just popped a yeah. listen to fly soups. Oh yeah, no, Cage 3 should not have taken that long, but, like, switching engines, and also, um, being, like, the first game that doesn't look like a PS2 game made it, like, there was a, it was a, it was a fresh start in the assets department. So, the combination of those two things, plus being announced too early, on top of it all, is why KH3's development time is such a meme. Oh, black and white hammers. I wonder if this fight will be different. No, this fight's the same. Gonna do the money grinding strat for this. Cause we have all these jackpots. I wish I had draw. It'd be nice for all these orbs that I have. They're spawning in really weird ways because of enemy randomizer. Floaty is a speedrun meme. Is it? That was some old discourse, wasn't it? Yeah, these enemies are weird. Like, they're spawning in a weird way. They're just, like, standing there, and they're actually giving me time to prepare. They're also not, like, in the moonlight. Oh, well, they kind of are, but... Hey, look at them. They're just, like, appearing. I actually really like that. It gives me time to prepare. For fuck's sake. This fight's improved, you know? I give though. That's a natural combo as a mash and reflect. How do they think that would not have been taken out of context? Those are the same localizers that did the Persona 1 localization. Where they did all sorts of racist things intentionally, not accidentally. 90s Atlas West. Whose fault is it that more SMT games didn't get localized in the late 90s and early 2000s? Is it Atlas West's fault, or is it Atlas's fault for not even, like, wanting to do, um, American versions, or global versions? Or is it, like, a shared thing between the two? It's my fault? Get him. You heard him. Get his ass. Or is it America's fault because of fucking being uptight about religion? I 
Like, they even thought, yeah, Pokemon, they thought was fucking Satanist. Imagine if a game with Satan in it was in America at that time. And SMT is an actually Satanist game, more or less. So imagine. Actual Satanist video game comes to America in the 90s. Imagine that. Oh, they give hell from nice. I don't know. I don't think that. I don't think that's the only reason. I don't think that's the only reason. It's probably a good reason, but not the only one. Like, Atlas Atlas was the company. Atlas was the Japanese company that... How long did it take for... Atlas games to get localized, like, before SMT5? Like, SMT5 was, like, the first Atlas game that was, like, simultaneous worldwide launch. And you even have shit like Persona 5 that was, like half a year of delay between JP and NA release. Atlas is the company that only recently stopped doing staggered releases. It took them that long. Something I'm proud about Atlas for is actually embracing the PC port um, scene when they did. All thanks to Persona 4 Golden, of course. But like... Nocturne HD having a PC port is not something I expected. Let alone... Oh, here's something that did take a while for them, actually. Fucking Nocturne HD. How long was the delay between JP and NA release for that? Man, I keep getting all my fucking limits stuck. God damn it. I'm trying to get EXP over here. I'm walking here. Yeah, just kill me. I totally forgot Nocturne HD took that long in the fucking list. It's a good thing they did, because they, um... Improved the game in time. Seven months? Fuck, I totally forgot about that. Oh, Psyax? Okay, dude, you know, okay, alright. All right. Just that final form. Look at this video game. Look at how it's working right now in this context. It, the game is the video game is working. The, the video game is working and not breaking under these fucking circumstances. You see this shit? Oh, I can't use Final Form here because a fucking stupid ass Jack who's gonna, probably gonna get killed by Psyax in all likelihood. I just realized it's gonna happen. Psyax fits this world well, better than the gambler character that shows up in this world. Are you sure? True though. Oh yeah, the Moonlight! I'm so fucking dumb. Fake! The Moonlight, you're right. This is a Moonlight-themed world. This guy's the Moonlight guy. Fuck, you are right. You are actually very smart. Um, I'm a fucking moron. Fake. Can't wait to see double DM in this fucking arena. How is Jack still alive? Oh! They removed the, the the lose penalty for him dying here, thank god. Very smart. Oh fuck, I should not have gone for that. No! If the third hit... If the third hit hit there, that would have 
gotten him out of it. That would have been the pro strat. Now we're in fucking double DM territory. Here we go. It's, it's a good. It's fine. I've, I've got the move in for this. Oh, 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 he's not fucking around. Get out of there. Oh, he doesn't fall for that in this version. Wow, that happens? You don't have to knock him out of it in story fight? Oh, that's funny. You got land cancelled, bitch. Oh, I don't have slide dash. I don't have a game. I can beat this guy. Oh, RC boost. I can beat this guy. I just need more juice to work with. This would probably help. It's fun this funny this funny little game where they make Jack dying a lose condition, but this game has the uh, oversight where when party members are removed from your party and you get that they relinquished their equipment message. When that happens, they lose all of their abilities and equipment. So you go into the fight, Jack has no fucking accessories or abilities, and they expect you to keep his dumb ass alive. Thanks, Square Enix. Same with Goofy when he dies, quote unquote. Yeah, most people. The moon's power. Most people. Have that happen? You know, it happens to me all the time. Oh. Dodge roll. The form is like level one right now, so that's like shitty dodge roll that we have. I misjudged you. Why did I burn all my drive like that for nothing? Looks cool though. That worked out pretty well. If you reflect that, you get drive back. Just a little bit, but it helps. I'm flying. I misjudged you. Fuck. Damn. He's gonna double DM, isn't he? Nah, I got him here. Check this out. No! Oh, whoa, okay. What the fuck? This game is getting a little too stoned for me. How is this working as well as it is? His animation is getting cancelled, like, constantly. But then he continues. Unexpected swag. I did a lot of damage. Thank you, RC Boost. Yeah, this fucking game. How does how does it function like this when it's put to these fucking when when it's stretched like this to its limits? You have fucking Syax showing up in this fucking dog ass arena with all these bumps and curves on the ground, and he's still DMing. Beautiful. Oh, that was the only thing for Port Royal. Nice. I probably could have left that world a long time ago, but... You know what we do. Oh, you know what? We might as well take advantage of this. Roxas is not going to be Roxas. I'll check this out. Oh, this fucking guy. The EXP potential here is actually so good, it's unbelievable. Look at look at this. Oh. Who is this guy? Uh who is this guy? I wonder if Valor counts for hits. Yeah. 
It does. As soon as I get magnets all over. I do have thunder though. I can't believe that doesn't have iframes. It's like the only one in the game. I'm learning that like for the first time. You're not safe when you fucking use that. It's unbelievable. It's such a cool RC until it's not. You ever fight these Tron enemies off the bike? Yes, you fight them in Space Paranoids 2, the first forced fight when you're saving Tron from the game grid. You fight these enemies. Okay, you gotta stop doing that. I gotta stop doing that. But I do need to kill them. Let's do this. This is like a budget version of Master uh, Final Fire. Look at this. Oh man. Stop doing the RC. As cool as it is, it's not fucking iframed. It's not like bats. We can do this. I need to level up Final Form. I could do that. There's a lot of places that have nobodies. Now that's randomized. Jeez. I have 43 magic. Oh. Oh, my drive. Just got fucking mulched. I just want the chest. Come on. Get out of my way. What did I just get drive for? Did you see that? Oh, it was me, it was me getting a drive in a box. I'm not used to that. Alright, let me room save so I don't have to get those items again when I die to fucking lingering will in the Roxas Arena. Oh, does one of the rewards not work? I think it's, um... One of them doesn't work. I had to get rid of it, but I didn't actually get rid of it in the thing. What is this? Scar. I am the key. Freeze. Freeze. This is gonna be interesting. I've never fought him as fucking. Oh. I've never fought him as normal Sora, and that's that's why. That's it's why. Sam's fault. I need, like, Kingdom abilities. Has I am the king. Oh, he backdashed out of that? Sheesh. Fuck this guy. Okay, well, we're coming back later. Get me the fuck out of here. We have a fantastic spot for EXP, though. So as soon as I, like, all up final or any other good crowd control, I'm gonna do that. Which I could do... Uh... Forgot what world had all the fucking... Dusks. Yeah. HP. Are you thinking vanilla game or the randomizer? Regardless, let's try it. Oh yeah, it did, you're right. Alright, uh, I need drive. I'm fucking running out of drive all the time. I could use the high drive, I need it. Yeah, be careful, my drive explosion doesn't count towards EXP. I mean, nobody's gonna need to kill, what is this? Ice cubes? Fire cubes? Okay, let's just do the fight. What's up, Brendan? Arrow thrusters? Rapid thrusters? That's what they're called. This will be easy. Statues and bombers? Okay, this won't be so easy. They're gonna bomb the wall. Hold up. Okay, they just scripted the bomb base still. Thank God. 
If they tried to bomb the wall, they probably would have gotten away with it. These guys are going ham, though. Look at this. Oh my god. Dude. Where the fuck is my limit for him? Hold on, let me, like, get auto limit here. I bet you could see uh, Leon's RC a lot more often. Like, say, you had, like, crazy-ass enemies here that, like, destroyed it. You could probably get recovery run really quickly. DP. Oh boy. Oh, I've been getting a bunch of Keyblades. Leaf Bracer, Form Boost, uh, Combination, whatever the fuck. Check that out later. Um, all my normal strats are like all topsy turvy because all the enemies are wrong. So I should just like I can just do like whatever the fuck I want. Let's see what uh, this world has to offer. Interesting mod. Oh shit, look at this. That's really cool. Oh, I need to get the... the classic quotes mod as well. Oh yeah, look at his feet, they're like inverting. Everything else looks pretty good though. More or less. Give me the extra attack. Nice to be able to use spells here, that's pretty fucking crazy. It's interesting, he has uh, Roxas combos, but Sora, everything else. I like that. I gotta take up high jump. It makes it hard to play as Roxas if you're jumping to the fucking moon. The Roxas segment of this game is like KH1, but like, really shitty feeling. This is like the best update Rando's ever gotten. I guess this is what Rando players on PC have been using ever since the fucking build from MM days, but... Fuck that. Now we have an actual fucking mod manager so that people can install this without reading a fucking 32 page document on how to install it. Gambler? Can I gamble with him? I can't. There's no RC. Fuck this guy. Eat that. Fucking dice. Yeah, this is the best update Rando's ever gotten. Is there a link to the updated guide? It's in the, uh, the Rando Discord. Hey, proof. It's the only thing here. Yeah, let me get yeah. the fuck out of here. Uh, now what? What else did I do? Let's do HP two. Let's see what it has to offer. I have organic valor form, don't I? I wonder if Bat Cry counts for Valor EXP. Oh, here's some nobodies. That's the biggest nobody of them all. Look at that guy. Oh, yeah. I should go and get all those fucking level ups again.
Oh, why is two become one like always fucking bad? I love two become one. There it is. The Cad Blade has returned. I wonder what enemy that's supposed to be. Fucking sorcerers. Uh, I got a lot of pages. Let's go loot this world real quick. Oh yeah, the books. Mm, the hooks. Randy, that's always nice. Wizard boost, that's the real prize. You know, I wish Sora's solo Trinity animation had more representation outside of Cage 2. Like, I, I kind of see it as one of his new essential moves. Like, if you were to, like, do a Hall of Fame of Sora's moves, which I guess is uh, his Smash character. I think solo Trinity should be up there with Ars Arcanum. I don't know. It's like one of the only things Sora can do to, like, escape an animation. It's either Trinity or Activated Drive. Yeah, it's funny they didn't get Strike Raid in Smash. Isn't that, like, what, like, the main... Part of his kit and like that that like Smash Flash game, there it's like he's a custom character in that. Isn't he like all about using Strike Raid? Mugen? No, not Mugen actually. I think there was something else. That's M Mugen is uh, just like a normal fighting game, but with custom characters. I'm thinking of a something else. But I'm sure he's in Mugen as well with all sorts of. Strike ready moves. Yeah, Smash Flash. Mugen is a really cool demi fiend. Mugen. Vagrant Mugen. Vagrant and Ronin Jin. Sorry, I watched the first episode of Samurai Shampoo the other day. Best show ever. Best anime. Speaking of good anime, I watched, um, I got Golden Boy, all six episodes of Golden Boy on VHS, and I was watching them on VHS the other day, and I was like, wow, this is good. Alright, now I can think we can do this. There's probably more pages that I could, uh... Get or uh, loot. I'll do that later. I want to kill these guys. I get. Imagine if I had an EXP boost. Give me strength. I didn't do it. Oh. Oh. Is the one dude I didn't get? When will they watch Golden Kamoy? Isn't that the anime with a really bad CGI bear? Defense. Defense. Yeah. 
Let's stop doing that, man. Fuck, just get the kills and then room safe. Yeah, I'm, did, did you guys see the clip on Twitter where they were showing, talking about how Brian Cranston did um, 90s anime dubs? That's like prime example of how 90s dubs are better. Even when they're like kooky, they're still better. But I could also grind, uh, I don't know if I grinded a limit here, I would get fucking one-shotted. They're hit and miss. I love hit and miss shows. I think even when they miss, though, it's still, like, more interesting than, like, an average modern anime dub where it's just boring. I'd rather it be funny than boring, unless it's, like, a real disservice to the show, but that's, like, a, that's a different story. Sailor Moon dub is the worst thing in the world, though? Yeah, I haven't heard it. Didn't, don't they, like, switch? Aren't there, like, three different Usagi VAs just over the course of all the episodes? They just keep fucking swapping them? Yeah, that I can't condone. I don't know. Maybe it's because I don't watch bad anime dubs. I don't really have a good opinion on the ones that are bad, so I just say that they're all good. Because I only care about the ones that are good, because I'm not lost-averse. Usagey, it's a hard A, okay. Let's go. Let's go. Ah. Oh, I thought you were helping me say the word correctly. Fuck me, right? Yeah, so again. It's Usagi. Usagi? Usagi? Is that it? Yeah, do. That's it? Okay. Samurai Shampoo is the best anime dub of all time. Better than Bebop, I might, uh... I might add. Maybe, I don't know. Man, I cleared the whole room just for that to happen. I wanted Valor hits. I want to level up Valor, but I can't. I did get fire though, so now I can actually kill them properly. Check this shit out. Yeah, painting and stocking as well is really good. Oh yeah, here we go. This is the juice right here. This is what I needed. Imagine if I had, um, Final Magnet. I could just pick up all these orbs automatically. I need MP, though. How much money do I have? I should have a shitload. Oh, yeah, I have enough for a decent stack of ethers. Let me get that. Yeah, this is a funny thing about enemy randomizers, is that sometimes you get, like, the most goaded EXP grinding strats. Maybe I should, like, not progress this world just so I have access to this for a while, I don't know. I have every level up checked, so I guess I can just do this until I'm, like, satisfied. Which I kinda am already. Look at my stats, 40- look at my stats! 47, 47, and 17. That's unbelievably glass cannony. That's, like, well, I guess that's because I'm in final form and I have boosted Keyblade stats, but still. Oh boy, oh boy. 
Oh, oh boy. That was two based. Let's go. Let's do that when I run out of MP. Look at that. Did you see what happened there? That final that specific final form finisher has natural crowd control on the final hit, and then I like casted fire out of it as if it were like built in magnet to the combo. You see that? That final hit gathers them like all on top of you. I'm gonna do it again. Take this shit out. Okay, do you see what happened there? If you don't like cast a spell out of it, you'll deal like a finishing blow that knocks them all away, but you can cancel that and do whatever crowd control you want at the end. Do you see that? Hold on. I'll do it again, because I keep dying. They should have made a whole game where you're a Final Form Sora, I think. I don't have combo mess, so I was trying to do the thing. Game is so good. I don't know. Okay. It's called Recoded. I don't, I don't, I don't know if that's what I said. It's a good, that's a good game, and you do have some Final Form stuff in there, like Exo Spark, but uh, not quite. Okay. Do you have Draw? I don't. That's like the one thing I want right now. Maybe I do have it. And I just didn't put it on because I've been leveling up so much in the past like two seconds. If I died right there. Maybe I have it now. Double drive converter? Okay. Don't mind if I do. Master form is gonna be so crazy. I'm not even gonna push this world, I just wanna leave this here so I can get more shit grinded. Yeah, maybe a keyblade, I don't know. Don't care enough. Let's see. Oh yeah, it does. I could dual wield it. I'll do that with um, Master later. Once I get it, if I get it. All right, let's. Um, I'm level 38 with 50 magic. We can do like anything now. Wow, they have it. Game of Girl. Let's do some Beast Castle action. Who knows what the first fight's gonna be? Oh boy, okay. Fucking Drive City over here, look at this. Fucking Drive City over here. What did I get on that last hit? I got, I got something. New ports. Look at that. Dual wielding Ultimus. So many fucking synth drops because of these jackpots and weird ass enemies. Based. I did get thunder, but that was before. I got another level up on top of that. What are these enemies? Oh, it was just black and white soldiers. Okay.
I think those are Halloween Town shadows, yeah. They're like textured. Do I have Glide Max? I feel like I do. Oh, I, I have Max everything. I was wondering why I was so fucking springy. Okay, well, I have Max everything. That's cool. Except for Dodge. Once I get Dodge Max, I'll be like as fast as humanly possible. Fucking classic. I remember I used to do, um, when Rando first came out on the PC version, like they released that, like, port of the, the code and whatnot, I used to do Schmovement Seeds where I had, um, everything at level 4 at the start of the game. And that's how I got really good at doing my stupid, like, uphill spell canceling shit that, like, all the, all the pro Rando players do. It's really easy, you just cast a spell when you're flying into, a, like, a slope and you get to be cool. I don't even know if it's that helpful of a thing to do, but it saves some inputs. I guess this is an honorary movement seed, no? It's cool. Jackpot only affects money, drive, MP, and HP orbs. What other kind of orbs are there? I guess synth drops. But, like, it's still, I'm killing so many enemies because of the fucking randomizer. So many of them are spawning. Shan was the one that made randos have plus one movement at the start. True, they did call it movement, but, I mean, that's not all that original of a concept. Oh! Well, I guess that fits in this world. Look at the door, is that the void? Is that the void of the world? It kinda is. Oh, this is about to get real fucking erotic in a second here. Perfect timing, yo, Kivis with the bits, thank you. Oh, 07. For that self shot. Hey, vicinity break. That's like one of the funniest abilities to have when you have high strength. Because vicinity break becomes as powerful as the fucking recoded version where it just one shots if you have good stats. What's up, Allie? Yeah. Okay, here's another like cool movement strat that is like something that you can use to like be stylish. The game remembers the direction that you aerial dived into. So if you tap square for glide, it'll just like give you a little boost in that direction because that's how glide works. Oh fuck, we're gonna have to do a two cycle now because I just ran out of grip. Ran out of bussy grip. Days and Recoded try to imitate this style of um movement. In fact, Days specifically has a version of Glide you can only do out of a out of a dash. You have to do it like fast enough. And then you'll activate Rocket Glide, which is really funny because it has no turning radius. You can't stop and if you hit a wall you get hurt. Oh. They have to they all have to come back here. Oh, this game's fast. You can turn but barely. You can it, the turning is turning with a rocket glide is a suggestion. I haven't had to do this in such a long time. I think this will do the trick. There we go. Please hurry. Move your fat ass, Miss Potts. You can do it.
You fuck. There you go. I think this will do the trick. Yeah, days. The developers at hand played Cage 2 and was like, how do we replicate this experience but on a DS? And they tried their fucking best. And if they made a PSP or a PS2 or PS3 game, it would have been just like this. Magnet burst, it's all over. Oh, there he is. Is he gonna get, like, frozen? Oh. Uh, the gimmick is still here? What about the Heartless? Oh, fuck, I don't know if this is gonna work. What kind of creepypasta shit is this, man? Does this have, a, like, a timeout? Does the game eventually give you mercy if this fucking happens? There's no Heartless to kill. I can't lock onto anything. Oh boy. Fell out of the map. Oh fuck. If I had magic lock on, I could thunder him no matter where he is, but I don't. One hit. Why would you do that over and over again? <laughs> He's just out of bounds. Of course he is. How do I get out of here? I, I haven't been saving. I could probably like use an auto save, but I don't want to like lose a bunch of progress. I, this I'm, this game doesn't have a suicide button like H1 Rando, or else I'd use it by now. The soft lock. Fuck. Where's where's the suicide button? I need it. I guess I could use the auto save. I would just have to risk. I have the soft reset. I do. I have soft reset and auto save, so I should probably just uh, do that. How do I? What's the button combo? Does anybody know? Soft reset. I guess I could just try pressing everything. What the fuck's gonna happen? There we go. Well, let's see if um, loading an autosave works. It should. You just load any save and then like hold a button and then it does it. There we go. Nice. I'll be back later with magic lock on. Look at look at how far we've progressed as gamers with our Kingdom Hearts. Look at how far we've come. Money farming zone? Hold on. Oh lord. If only I draw. I do have draw. Hold on. Yeah, we can grind master and final here. And money. Oh, I have drive converter on. I should take that off for this. And if I run out of fucking drive, I can always come here and do that as well with my converters on. Alright, we're gonna double fist these fucking orbs. Check this out. my drive bar because I, uh, yeah. When you get turned into a card with a drive form, your gauge goes down to two and it caps out at two because it matches the card's drive 
gauge or whatever. Okay. That's a funny word, gauge, gauge. Aren't both of those pronunciations correct, technically? It's just a regional thing. Zero strength keyblades are actually pretty useful in rando when you're grinding valor form and you have like high strength you want to get as many hits as you can in. I'm well above the cap of this world though. Zero one combo- that's my combo master keyblade for the day? Fucking zero one monochrome? Fuck. Uh, I'll probably end up using it at some point when I'm like level fucking 60 and I can use whatever keyblade I want and stats don't matter. Oh, that's not too bad. God damn. Second chance, 6-3 though, that's pretty good. I'll need that with 23 strength, that's pretty good, that's top tier. Oh yeah, isn't there like a Days Keyblade mod with new rando? Or open cage rather? New rando, what are you saying? Isn't there a Days Keyblade mod? We're gonna get that. I'll install that right now. Good night, Kibis. What's up, Joel? Everybody plus Joel. Yo, guess shot. Thank you for the bits. Thank you for shooting yourself. Guess there's no mod. I was waiting for Fred to give me the hookup, but I don't know if he knows. Or if it even exists. I swear I've seen rando players that were using the old fucking build from MM shit have uh, days keywords. But I guess not. Maybe not for PC. Where should I go? What about me? I was asking if you knew um, if there's a days keyblade mod. I'll install it right now if there is. I do one off stream of the Osaka game, the May Before Recon. Maybe that game looks just ever, just painfully mid. Nothing like bad or good about it. I don't know. I don't know jack shit about open cage mods. Could you check? I like that fish from SpongeBob. Could you check? No. I've not done TT. Let's go. make a cage one ultimate mod. It's in this, actually. Once I get, I think, Master Form, I'll have it. Cage one ultimate in this. It's built in to Rando now, at least on this version. You can use Cage 2 patches with the PC mod manager. I don't know if there's a difference between the Cage 2 patch and Cage 2 PC patch. I didn't know that there was a distinguishment, a difference, whatever the fuck. It's for emulator? Yeah, I guess. That makes sense because I'm PC in the title. There's Auto Master. I 
I'm flying around really fucking fast. My favorite. I have 37 deaths, look at that. That's crazy. I wonder what enemies are gonna fucking show up here. These fuckers, okay. Ultimate mushroom. Hand did a lot of ports, didn't they? Or just like, not ports, but like, contract work for like, big studios. I don't know. Okay. Yeah, the wisdom form combo plus was really weird in vanilla, I remember. I was like, this is weird. There's another proof. I'll probably try... We're gonna do a blackout seed. So that I experience all the randomized bullshit, or at least most of the randomized bullshit that the seed has to offer. This fucking this game, this game, it's just too good. It's too good. I fucking use a spell. Um, you can do that in Cage Three. Now nah, people don't be saying that. Game's too good. Just post people talk. Okay. Yeah. Thanks, Nightbot. Nightbot has no sub. That's true. Nightbot doesn't have a sub. That's a disaster. I wish somebody would fix that. Yeah. Who among us could be our hero? Chaos Jack steps up. Thank you very much. Thunder boost. And another. I got triple reflect. Nice. 
And normal aerial recovery, thank god. Oh, I got a money pouch at some point, I have 5k, nice. Good. Oh, that's the only thing in 100 Acre Wood? Nice. There's one we're flying up. Now we got it. Uh, let's get some Master EXP. Let's go back to Beast Castle. Oh, Donald, you really need to be disabled. Hold on. Let me go beat their legs real quick. There we go. And I just gotta wait until I get hurt enough to use, um, auto. There's one more hit. There we go. There we go, okay, that, we got it, that's enough, that's enough, that's enough! Save that. Sheesh. I, why did I take off the drive converse? It was gonna be on. They gotta be on for that, not off. I think I also meant to put on my draw keyblades, but whatever. It's good enough. Oh, I deal so much fucking damage. Oops. Nice, double negative. There we go. Time to do some funny shit. Check this out. See how Sora says his finisher quote in master form where you don't have finishers? Check that out. Look at that, Ultima. I could get my form still levels. No, I've got. I was about to say I could get him to level six, but that's wrong because I don't actually have master and limit. Yeah. Or stats in case one ultimate. I can't see yet until I like legitimately unlock the form, or else I would be able to equip it. Where should I go? Let's do some aggro action. Why not? This is a funny world for vicinity break. Oh, I don't have a sandy break. Fuck, hold up, hold up. I can do this though. Yeah, right. All right. Motion sick, you're not motion sick, you're not motion sick. Drugs in my garage. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Thunder, thunder.
Hey, there's a magnet. Dudes at the end, fuck them. Yeah. There's not a magnet. There it is. Oh yeah, somebody post the 7TV email of the, of the dog on the phone. That one's- uh, that's also a new emote. That has been added. I think it's called like OO or something. A L O O. Yeah, there it is. There it is. Thank you. Light. All right, what enemy awaits us behind door number four? Oh, okay. Hey, I'll make it all stop. That's fitting. That's actually very fitting. Holy fuck! It's his minion. Anyways, he's fucking dead. <laughs> okay. I think I was mashing triangle. You know what, Axel? You're fired. Let's go kill Barbosa. I want to see if I can kill him through the wall. I wonder if that was Axel 1, like the first Axel you fight. What does that save? Oh yeah, that's fine. Somebody added the lethal flame to Cage 3. I like how you called it Lethal Flame. That's that's old school. You played Recom on the PS2. You wanna know how I can tell? Because that was a typo, in like that version only. Uh, wrong place, I'm not supposed to be here. This is where Barbos is supposed to be, but not, not, in, uh, not in this funny little version of the game that we're playing right now. Yeah, Sandlot, Axel 1. Put frame? Did he? No, you didn't. Don't gaslight. Anyways, in the PS2 version, the first translated version of that game, it's called Lethal Flame with an L. It's supposed to be called Lethal Frame. Oh yeah, you're right, there was Fire Floor involved. That was, uh, maybe, uh, Axel 2. Uh, the Roxas version, I think, maybe. I don't know. Oh! Well, fucking- uh, okay. Don't ever look behind you, I guess. Alright, let's see if we can do this now. Nice, okay. Alright, you know what? You're fired. 
He doesn't freeze anymore. He doesn't have any ailments on him. I like how Magic Lock on is suddenly an S tier ability when shit like this can happen. That's really funny. It's like. It's like a 90s RPG where you need one specific optional item to get past like a certain boss fight. But that item isn't like given to you in like any straightforward way, so you have to find it and you have to buy a fucking guide to find the item. That's what that is. My stats are so high, it doesn't matter what keyboard I'm using, I'm just using Finishing Plus. Oh, well, in some worlds it matters, fuck it. Uh, give me a cool keyboard, yeah. Oh, my abdomen hurts! I hate when my abdomen hurts. As a result of exercise. You talking about Megami Tensei 1? Yeah. I should have said 80s JRPG then. But I was also thinking about SMT1 where I fucking... The only thing that got me through... Arachne and fucking... Um... That one dungeon. I was just throwing magic mirrors because they cost like two dollars in that game. Yo, Claybold underscore Clay sold. Old school, but with an underscore. Welcome back. And Hacky with the Prime Gaming sub. How come the Caliburni crew always shows up like all at the same time? What's up, lads? Thank you very much for the 10 months, Hacky. Hive mind, it's true. Maybe when one shows their face, another one steps up. Instinctually. Where should I go now? Maybe, um, some world I usually neglect. Let's go to Olympus. How do I sell people in September? Is it like really 20% off for everybody? Is it only 20% off for resubs or like new subs? How does it... I feel like September only benefits people that are already like subscribed and like nothing changes. I don't know. Oh yeah, there, you get that emote, that fucking... No, that, that emote's free, though. That The emote that looks like Jack Frost. It, that's free. You don't even have to, like, participate in order to get it. It's just a global emote. It's, like, one of the best emotes on the fucking website in terms of global emotes, but it's, it's free. It went from 20 to 25 with Prime. Is that true? Yeah, there's a third proof. Yo, kids on Black Ops with the five months and the info. Thank you very much. Yeah. Yeah, they really just made a fucking official Jack Frost emote, but it'd be cool if you had to sub during September to get it. I don't know. It's literally just Jack Frost, though. You can't convince me otherwise. It's just zoomed in on his face. How cute is he out of me and Jack Frost? That was great. That, that is a better birthday gift than anybody could have provided. Birthday art's pretty cool. I like that concept. Yeah, now we can beat the game, but I'm gonna do a Blackout Seed just to get the most out of the fucking crazy-ass randomized shit on our table today. Huh. That's it! Huh. That's it! Ha! Is that all you got? Light. Take that! That's my best crowd control. I could have just done double negative. Oh, there it is. Yo, Claybull with the gift of a Kakarot. Real shit? Hey, 
this out. I wish I had that name. When was that account created? Like 2007? Eight? I was close. I was close. I wonder what Hades is gonna be. Hades? Uh, the dog. Hades is dog. Uh, Cerberus? I wonder what Cerberus is gonna be. Huh? Oh! It's Beast. Already up my ass. Okay, dude. Alright. Where's my slide dash? I don't have it yet. Oh! The, the damage! Oh, Cogsworth is- Cogsworth is here! What? He's here? This game is so well made. Well, fake? Hold on. I think that fucked up because I land cancelled it. I was on a slope. Okay, hold on. There we go. The finisher? Does he always do that? You always get the finisher animation there? That, that's not normal, right? You, you don't normally get the sound. I think that's that's what that's what made me pog. Is that you don't... You, do you normally get the finisher sound there, or do you get something else? I think you get something else in the normal game. That was cool with the sound. Man, sound is so important in video games. I, I've been thinking about the Daykaja sound effect, like, all week. Sound is so important, and fuck, that's that's something that modern game devs are fucking up as they try to, like, put, like, 300,000 polygons in between Ringo's ass cheeks in Soul Hackers 2, you know? Like, they've lost the plot because they don't realize, they, they don't, they don't realize how important sound is. They're so distracted by visuals and, like, art style, which is, which is cool and all, but, like, still, they're so distracted by, like, Everything that isn't sound. And sound is just like an afterthought. They just like put it in. Oh yeah, just put in this Dekaja sound effect that you can't hear. Put in all these fucking realistic gun sounds that nobody will remember. Instead of the fucking... The PP2000 from Modern Warfare 2. You can hear it in your head right now. You can already hear it. You can already hear that fucking jingling key sounding ass gun. You can already hear it in your head if you've played that game. You can already hear it just by me saying it. You've heard it. Modern games? Modern FPS games? Good luck. The Bloodborne gun sound effect. Oh, that's all I have to say. In October, Timeout with Bits will be half off, and it will make the Bloodborne gun sound effect. Get excited. Fuck September, it's gonna be Bloodborne Gun October here shortly. Let's hope he remembers. I've been thinking about that all year. Fuck you. How many times have I said that on stream that I'm gonna do that? Fuck you. FPS Fridays one. I might bring that back. It might be shooters. With, it's gonna FPS Fridays is gonna be resurrected in the form of shooters with sham on on Sundays. We're kind of already doing that with with fucking Borderlands co-op Sundays. But after Borderlands co-op Sundays, we're gonna start playing Halo on Sundays. Shooter th with Sham sounds like we're doing shots with you. That might happen too in the future. I was literally doing shots last time I streamed Slackers too. Where am I going? Oh yeah, just go. Open their sub lobby for Halo. It'd actually be single player. But maybe we'll do some multiplayer stuff. I could do Halo 3, boot up all the the fucking classic Halo 3 fucking 
custom games and do a stream of that. That'd be sick as fuck. Selgers 2 still in the honeymoon phase is actually worth getting. Um... I was about to say yes if you're an SMT enthusiast, but then I just realized it's actually probably the opposite way around. It's an alright game. It's neat. It's good for a first playthrough. It's not worth $60 though. It's worth $40 at most. Cool Oblivion today. What the fuck? I'm gonna use that. Yeah, meanwhile, Halo Infinite sucks ass. I'll put Oblivion on final form, actually. I like Ultima. Wait, what's Fenrir? I'm, I'm using Fenrir today. They killed Halo Infinite by... It's a live... It's a free-to-play live service game with no live service. Do lasso runs, no balls. How about I attach your balls to a lasso and then drive my Pontiac G5 down the street at 40 miles an hour? How do you feel about that? Hmm? Dance, water, dance! I do drive a Pontiac, but it's it's more like um. I forgot the other car. That's like the exact same thing. What was that car? Remember when I was playing Midnight Club Three on Midnight Club Mondays, and I like bought that car? I should be more specific. Um. There's the final stream of Midnight Club Mondays, and I bought that, like, fucking C-tier car. It's, like, blue. I drove it around for, like, ten minutes. It wasn't even one of the SMT cars, it was just... It's because my brother was there, and I bought my brother's actual car, at least at the time. He actually had to get a new one since then, but... That's besides the point. Ah, oh, what's the name of that car? Fuck. Nissan? No. Maybe? No. I don't think so. Gaia? No. It's a... Chevy, I think. No. A Chevy Ford? Yeah, it was the Cobalt, yes. A Chevy Cobalt. Pontiac made a car that is basically just the, the Chevy Cobalt platform. It's like the exact same car. I actually don't know if it was Pontiac that made it and then like Chevy made their own version, but I think it was the other way around. Yeah, it's either a Pontiac G5 or a G6. It was a hand-me-down as my first car. I still have. Is this world done? It is. Let's see what boss this is. Pull up in a Ford Focus. Pull up in a Ford Focus. Pull up in a Chevy Ford. Skirt, 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 skirt. Hey, it's Sark with his minions. Data transfer. Give up. Data transfer. Data transfer. I didn't press triangle hard enough, I guess. Is that all you got? Data transfer. He knows Blizzard. What is this? Why is the time bar in the top left really low res? You see that? Look at that. I noticed that earlier. Against Cyax. Why is it like 480p? Okay, hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. New swag just got unlocked. Hold on. Wake up, you fuck. You stupid ass. Dude, wake up, I want to swag. Hold on. Get up! You fuck. 
Get out of here. Oh, oh great, now I can't swag because I ran out of juice. Hold on, I, now I have to wait. He's like stun locking him, what is this? I'm trying to parry the, the frisbee with final form so I can be cool, but I ran out of juice. I'll take it. I think Goofy did that. No, I dropped a bunch of frames as soon as I did that. Whatever. Thanks, Comcast. Gather. I have to remember that next time I'm playing this game and I have Final Form there. My favorite thing to do with Rando, as I'm not one of those Rando players that's like, Oh, I'm gonna boot up Rando, man, I got a really fast time, I'm gonna enter tournaments, be 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 be. I boot up Rando to, like, play this game as if it were Bloody Palace and just do, like, whatever creative shit I can think of. Gather. Like, whatever, like, funny reaction commands that you can, like, put to use. Cool exploits you can do with, like, having certain forms early and, like, Bas yeah, cool bits of juicing you can do. My favorite. What am I doing this fight? I can't use final AI, I'm out of fucking orbs. Oh, let me dump all my, uh, spells. Finishing plus on. Oh, where am I? Oh, he's dead. The Pontiac G5 is a rebadged Chevy Cobalt. Yeah, that's right about the car. But I said it was a G6 because that stupid fucking song, like in G6, like in G6. Na 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 na. Now I'm feeling so fly. I got G6. But they mean the they mean the plane and not the car. Fuck that song. <laughs> that era of music was really something. It's funny to look back on like the LMFAO fucking era of like party meme music, but it sucked ass in the moment. I am nostalgic about it. I bet I can kill Scar. Yeah, I absolutely can kill Scar now. I, I want an explosion though. I'll do that later. Or some other... I want a ground combo, I think. Yeah. I gotta use this doink ass keyblade to fucking have cool combos now. I should guarantee combo master on seeds like this. I think I'm gonna start doing that. I make my own fucking seed settings. Yo, Bond of Flame with a Blizzy Boost, best keyblade in the game. This fucking cartoon boy yoing fucking ass keyblade. Somebody okay Is it possible to replace keyblade sounds in KH3? Because if so, somebody should make a cartoon sound effect mod for the, the whatever fucking keyboard has cartoon sounds. I mean, they all do. You don't even need to make that mod. But, like, genuine, like, Twitter cartoon meme sound effects. Like, all the, you know, all the hitters. Like, genuinely. Yeah.
Yeah, the goofy ah sound effects, like the the, the genuine one. That'd be a good meme. Like, hold on, let me, let me pull out some of the, the hitters. I was just working with these earlier today for a meme. Why is it so quiet? <laughs> Yeah, like that. Like, imagine with, like, those sound- that tier of, uh, you know. Yeah, penis music sound effects, that's exactly the right term. Where should I go? Beast Castle isn't done yet. Yo, Ed, Ed and Eddie been off the air for years. off the air for some time now and all these people are mad out here about Ed, Ed and Eddie getting cancelled oh this is not randomized okay good honestly when a parent tells you no you gotta respect that, but Drake just does whatever he can. Who is this guy? Uh, who is this guy? The fact. It's probably a gimmick fight that needs to be unrandomized, or else the game will fucking explode or whatever. Mark seen? But oh, which one? Okay, just absent, I think. No fuck. He's got good damage resistance here, it seems. Oh, this gimmick doesn't work in a small arena like this. Cabe. Combo modifiers. How the fuck do I even like kill her without sliding dash? It seems success. Ah! Oh, the the jolts. I forgot. No matter where you are, you still get shot. Okay, well. I don't have fucking slide dash and whatever. I'll just save my final form for her and then I'll have her. What? You can do that? I thought you were going into the wall. What was that? That was weird. Have a good night, Ren. Enjoy bottomless brunch tomorrow. What is that, like, brunch, but there's no twinks there? Interesting. Enjoy the peace and quiet, I guess. I could have merged in there. I actually don't want them to be merged. Oh, 
No, 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 wait, 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 wait. That almost had her. Damage, what the fuck? What the fuck? If that were PS2, I wouldn't have gotten hit there. For the record. Really? Can I outrun this? I can. Oh, that goes really far. Okay. I didn't think that would go out of bounds. There we go. Platinum ring. I don't know why I said it like that. Cielo is far greater than you. What else is on the table? I guess Disney Castle. I don't need these, all these bats anymore. Let me kill them one last time though. This was fun. Look at all these bats. Look at the orbs! Oh man, imagine this with fucking classic sound bug. He's so good. Check this out. Destruction. That would have been so loud back on the old version. You know what? I wonder if I can try down patching. Hey, that's not gonna work, right? With Rando, I can't down patch. So the old EXE that had that. I should try that, because, you know, we have autosave. I don't need to worry about all the other crashes that would happen on that EXE. But that's probably going to cause all sorts of new issues. I'll try it one day. This way. Yo, V-Ray, with the two months, thank you very much for continuing that Prime Gamer sub. I appreciate them. Oh, you know what I have? I have auto limit. I think I still have that on. Let's try uh, using that. It's gonna take a long time to get into it, but. It'd be nice for this room. I right, need to get some movement levels, maybe we'll get explosion. 
doesn't matter a ton. Yeah, I'm sure if these guys would rent would I'm sure if they were randomized it might fuck up the game or something. I don't know. If you see a room like this where enemies aren't randomized, you can assume that it might be that way on purpose. There we go. I don't have auto limit on. Unfortunate. I guess I took that off at some point. Whatever. Alright, you know what? Can I get an orange over here? I can just magnet them. Nice. Love being able to do that. Oh yeah, it's probably because Mini would like get insta-killed by real enemies. Instead of these slow fuckers that just like kind of drift around and vibe. Unless you get near them. Oh, I actually died. Yeah, just like fucking Cinderella escorting BBS rando. You remember that shit? Alright, at least now I can try using auto limit. It's the only one I don't have. I guess I can speed this up by just walking into all of them and having them hit me one after another. Because these are like special versions of this enemy, well, not like different versions, but they have different AI. This is where all the all they do is this, and they don't do any like bolt reversal shenanigans or anything else they do, it's just this one move. This game has a lot of shit like that, you don't even really realize like um, enemies fighting walls instead of you. Ragnarok is so good here when you apply magic. Did you know that you actually have to hit a uh, Giga Impact to get limit EXP here? Like, if you get the other two impacts, you don't actually get the EXP. It has to be perfect for limit grinding. Oh, I fucked it up. Whatever. This way. Give me the R's in the final hit. Well, that one makes sense because of um. This way. That's the same with Sonic Blade and its final hit. This way. And Strike Raid. But it's interesting that the first two RCs of Ragnarok that you don't use work the same way. Let's go. Oh. Oops. This way. This way. Let's go. Did you know you can smooth out a tinfoil ball in the microwave? What is this, like, TikTok misinformation? That used to be a big thing before TikTok. I don't, I don't think it was a Vine thing, but it was just a thing in general where there was all sorts of fucking gaslighting and people getting their fucking electronics broken because they were listening to people online. It was a funny era. Also, this world is done. I'm just gonna get the chests and then leave. How did Vine die but TikTok get big? It's because TikTok actually monetized their platform properly. Vine didn't, I guess. Not well enough, at least. How are you not dead? There you go. Like, Vine didn't have, like, any ads at all. It just had content. And, like, nothing else. 
Vine was purposefully retired. Is that true? For what reason? Weren't they like bought out? Look at these fucking enemies out of here. When's the next Solidarity 2 stream? Um, probably tomorrow. Unless I feel like not streaming tomorrow, but we'll cross that gate when we cross that bridge. Yeah, TikTok was all about music, wasn't it? That's still one of its best features, is how easily you can integrate music into the fucking app. Gather. Where am I going? Beast Castle still has something. Beast Castle 2 has something. Let's go to TT2, I guess. Let's see what the fucking Sandlot fight's gonna be. drive because I fucking spent it all just trying to kill like two enemies. Oh, look at these boosts. China likes to monetize kids and their stuff. There's, I think every country likes to monetize children using the platform. Like, any, any app just benefits from that. It's not just a China thing, naturally. There's the good money-making strategy thing. Oh, fuck. You know, these enemies are, like, just as bad as fucking actual berserkers, come to think of it. What a fitting replacement. America loves to monetize their kids. Just look at fucking kids having to bring money to school to fucking pay for their lunch. Gather. Something as basic as that. Gather. Think about it. Is your family missing? Think about it. Like that assault riders show up there over the dragoons that are there to jump scare you. That's pretty fitting as well. Yeah, Fortnite is like the first game that like really truly made like the optional cosmetics become something of like a mandatory thing. I never saw well, maybe count maybe CS:GO. You had people making fun of other people for having default skins, but you, you didn't really. I never heard the term "default" as a derogatory until Fortnite. TF2, Valve in general, TF2 and CS:GO. Valve invented the fucking modern schemes of video game monetization. CS:GO, you get fucking cases, but you need to buy the key in order to like, roll the the dice. Hold the lever, whatever the fuck. TF2 and its fucking hats. But I think, um, C CSGO did it better. The fucking skins market. You guys excited for the launch of Overwatch 2? Crickets. I'll still eat that garbage. Give me strength. Gamblers. Gamblers everywhere. Alright, these enemies are normal. 
Tornado steps, rare RC, hold on. Oh no, they killed me with a rare RC. Alright, hold on, I gotta take advantage of this. Tornado ride, very, very rare RC. It doesn't even work properly in like the one opportunity you have to use it. They should announce Peggle 3 and have the same guy come out on stage and do the exact same jump. They should just, they should make Peggle 3 and just do the exact same um, announcement for it. Peggle 3! And he jumps up and does a fist pump. People are actually going to cheer this time. That'll be swell. Mickey, you fuck. You better not ruin this for me. Here we go! Let's go! Let's go! So cool. You get to move around with it, you get to control it. Like Rodeo. I got but the funniest thing about that RC is that it shows up and fucking... It shows up after Port Royal 1 in the room before Barbosa, which has an uneven floor, so like... The RC breaks because you like, you, you fall down. And it, it cancels the animation. So like, it doesn't even work in like the one optional place where you might find them. I think they show up in Olympus as well, but that's like... Oh, uh, cups. They show up in, like, Magnet Thunder territory. You do float, but the, the floor is uneven. Maybe it's not land canceling that kills it, but you, like, you, you, you go up and, like, you land on something and it fucks it up. I don't know. I remember going out of my way to find those enemies once, and that's where they were. And that happened, and I was like, oh, that's funny. It's one of those things that just got the lighting dash. It's one of those things where you have to go out of your way to see the RC. That's why it's rare. Either I missed the chest or this is a very backloaded TT for once. I did not miss the chest. I missed something in Timeless River, but that's probably because I didn't do that world mostly. I don't need to. Missed the first chest in fucking world that never was. Probably because I died a billion times trying to get those fucking chests. Alright, Axel fight. What do we have? I'm having a great day. What's up, kid? Right, that fight was normal. It's just a map? Okay, yeah. I must have died like 40 times trying to get it. Just for a map. I think this whole fight might be normal because of Axel. Yeah. Oh! No, oh, those enemies are new. It's like partially normal, I don't know. I wonder where limit form is. Or pure blood, wherever the fuck that keyblade might be. Is there something on a data? This is data axle, isn't it? Hold on. Two more chests, and then we get to see what data axle will have. It's not even gonna be data axle, right? It's gonna be some other fucking thing, scaled to level 99. Let's see it. Data Pete. Now I turned pure blood back on. I just noticed that it was off when I opened up the seed for today. I was like, oh, that was off. That's why I didn't show up last time. That's why. There's nothing in here, is there? Yeah. That's the cool thing about the seed generator is that it saves your settings from the last time. Like you don't even have to make presets. It'll just save whatever the settings were. But you can make presets as well. Oh, I just got parried in midair. What the fuck? I actually did see Donald and Goofy in the classic outfits in uh, Disney Castle. I saw that last seed. Get on. Oh, I'm getting fucking domed. Soccer ball to the face. That's different. 
Where would I see them in the, um, the other outfits then? Last chest. Thunder and it's blue. Okay. I still want to see what the data is though. Let's see. Where do they show up? If not there. I have to touch the beam. I thought that was where the data room was. Is it here? It is. It's an actual door. Forgot they did that. Gather. Forgot they did that. That's cool. It's on fire. How fitting. It's this fuck. How fitting. Data. Data Hades, man. Okay, hold on. I'm beating him. That's really fitting. Let's see how much damage fucking double blizzard boost will do. Let's just not get fucking killed right away this time. Let's raise my magic stat. How do I not have um, a Zexian accessory? Yeah, change the door so it doesn't look Pete related. I, I don't know why they didn't use that door. Maybe it's just not an entity that they can spawn. I don't know. This is just like the Axel fight, just fucking camping with Blizzard. It's not a lot of damage. It's not like this guy's a paragon of difficulty either. Unless I get one shot by that. To reflect him. Alright, here we go. I can reflect the, the wall into him, I think. This is, um... Not Olympus 2 Hades. He's not doing his fire power-up thing, thankfully. I can put myself in the limit if I hurt. I can't get hurt. The walls don't have hitboxes. Okay. I thought they would. Nice combo. This is like a version of Hades that only throws fireballs and does nothing else other than that combo. Oh fuck! I think I have this. Ragnarok might be good here. Oh, nice elbow. He doesn't ever break out, except for when he does and almost kills me. At the end of the fight! Beta KH1 clothes? Oh, and they, sh they, they have them in the absent silhouette rooms. Okay. I'll keep an eye out for that. That's neat. I didn't know that those existed at all. Speaking of Scar, let's kill him now that I have Slide Dash. Have a good night. Oh, Mega Bear. Oh, I can't get... It's just a map. It's just a map. Don't get the fucking chest. It's just a map. While we're at it, put on the fucking second chance keyblade, please. 
Tipo isso. Finals and this isn't randomized. That's kind of a shame. But it's, I feel like it's always been that way, at least. I am the key. Freeze. Freeze. I feel like it's been that way since PS2, Rando. I remember. Also, that's a fucking combo. Maybe I should be using second chance instead, or once more instead. I think everything here is like a natural combo instead of a, like a yeah, like a multi-hit instead of a fucking, you know. You got damage though. Oh, okay. Big, big fucking mistake. You just made, you just fell through the trap. I Did I drop my R's? I was mashing triangle there. I was about to remark how weird it is to be fucking doing the R's loop on fucking Scar, but it dropped. It never happens to me. R just does that? I mean, yeah, he breaks out, but I didn't continue my R's. Oh, I don't have the key weight on. Line Sora can also fucking land cancel or reflect, which only Final Form can do otherwise. It's like, uh, once more? Uh, uh, what? Once more? Uh, excuse me? Once more? Please? Please work? Once more? Fuck's sake, what is that? They put on the wrong keyblade? Was that... I don't know. Is that not Kingdom Key? Was that like Cad Blade or the other one? Alright, here's how we do this. Look at, look at this damage. Dude. At least he's not gonna try attacking me. Ever when he does. Is he DMing? I think I can deal with this. Whoa! Ooh. He's fast. Please land. Well, can I do what? Look at that damage though, it's like an entire fucking bar. My anger has grown of course. He's just like Roxas for real. Oh shit. If only I had limit form and not auto limit, I could actually probably reliably use that once or twice. Oh, yeah, I do need to check SC, doesn't it? Oh, no. Did I put on a second chance key, but I wasn't even looking. That must have been what that was. Oh, look at the damage, though. He's a big hitbox. He takes all the damage to that. Okay. That was supposed to combo him. At least we can do MP rage strats here. But I have plenty of ethers. Don't do that. Can I go into the fight with, like, no health? I wonder if I can enter this fight with like blinking health so I can always use auto limit right away. Yeah, that's zero health. That's a bit too much. Okay, 
Okay, that's reliable. Look at the damage of that, it's so fucking like, big. This is like KH1 Ragnarok hitting like... Oh man. It's like when Cage 1 Ragnarok hits uh, like Parasite Cage or like Final Ansem point blank and like it deals a whole health bar of damage. Oh! Big fucking mistake. I love this game. There we go. Sweet memories, how fitting. Finishing plus. Damage drive. Another really good ability. At some point in the seed, we gotta see what replaces Sephiroth. Accessory slot. Nice. So cool getting those in chests. That's a that's a new thing. Never used to be that way. These stats are like crazy for Arando seed. 57 fucking magic at 42. That's like unusually high. My defense is unusually low as well. That's why everything else is so high. It's the best kind of seed. If this were old Rando and you don't get health in chests. I would have, like, half the health I have right now. That's something that ra new Rando did that kind of buffs everybody. Is that you have a shitload of health now. Relative to how it used to be. Yo. Number 72 with the 20 months. Welcome to the gang. Thank you very much. I wish... I said this, like, the other day, but I wish that Twitch had, um, special emotes you would get for being a long-time sub, instead of, like, a tier 2 or a tier 3 fucking emote. It should be, like, at 6 months you get this new emote. That'd be cool. I have so many good ideas that would benefit this website. Alright, who's gonna spawn? How fitting. Both of those enemies have like frame one hitboxes when they spawn. How fitting. I think Twitch would run better if it weren't owned by Amazon. If it weren't run by Amazon, it probably wouldn't be running at all. I don't think Twitch not ran by Amazon would have survived up to this point. In fact, they, they're not even profiting that much, right? They're just kind of like maybe breaking even. Are they bleeding money? Is that true? Being a bleeding money, why am I bleeding fucking... Frames. Whatever. Back. Yeah, Amazon can afford to have it, and I guess they profit off this website in ways that aren't directly tied to getting returns. Also, this boss. Glad to see it still has these fucking annoying phase transitions. Or does it? It does. Isn't there like an invisible wall you can go through in this version of the arena? Oh, they actually modified the arena so that it's not there anymore. Okay. You can go out of the bounds now. multi-hit, though. Got 
There we go. Sometimes Wisdom in Final Form's Thundaga finisher will knock a big target around so much that it knocks them into the other Thundaga, because it'll be like three or four Thunders in like a big area. And sometimes it'll knock the enemy into multiple of them, so you get like a, a multi-hit Thundaga finisher where you normally don't. And it's really cool. Which is like YouTube and that the profit's non existent. That's why Amazon and Google push their premium service. That's how they make money. Yeah. Yeah, Prime is their premium service on Twitch, yeah. Nothing else. They should think of something else. Mile. No! Oh, fake? Oh! The camera panning. Oh! That's pretty scenic. Whoa. That is scenic. What the fuck? Alright, this is Kino. Look at that damage. Wow. Put me in auto limit. This is gonna kill me. Do I have guard? I do. Where's the bird? He is bird, he has no idea where he is. Yeah, it's Sean Yu. Fake. This is, um, ooh, this might not work. Oh, look, there it is! There it is! This is what I needed. I love that it spawns in the fucking room somehow. They gotta fix- why are the health bars or the- yeah, why are the gimmick bars fucking, like, 240p, you see that? The texture is all fucked up. That's, why is that a PS2 texture? Get that shit out of here. This is the PC version. Looks like shit. Oh, one fucking thing. Too early. You're supposed to reflect that. The RC is broken. Am I dropping frames? I'm dropping frames for a second there. I wonder what the final phase of this fight's gonna look like. There we go. I gotta improv this because I don't have master form on demand. This is a good backup strat if you don't have like master form ready to go in the real fight, like a story fight here. Although it's hard to get this far away from the boss in the real fight, right? 
You have to get really far away so that all five of the blizzards converge from Wisdom Blizzard Finisher. But that works really well. If I died from something like that, that'd be so silly. That was cheaper than Thunder. I don't know if, um... Wisdom Thunder finisher is not gonna hit the same amount of times as Master Thunder. It might have worked, I don't know, but Blizzard was cheaper and more reliable there. Like PC random more than PS2 random? Of course I do. Fucking, I love playing fucking PS2 rando at 30 FPS with 14 frames of input delay. I hated that shit so much, it sucked ass. After getting used to 60 FPS PS4 and Xbox versions, going back to fucking emulator rando at 30 FPS felt like I was dragging my nuts through water just to fucking press X. That's how bad the delay was. I was like playing the game like half a second in advance. Or rather like half a second behind. I was like pressing inputs and then watching Sora do the action like 10 seconds later. I think I combined the sayings dragging your nuts through glass and playing underwater. I combined the two sentiments into one, it didn't make sense. But yeah, it felt like I was playing KH2 underwater. Look at these fucking enemies. The worst enemies in the game! Sentiments? No, I said sentiments with an M, fucker. Gather. World's done. Oh yeah, it is. One more fight, though. I wonder if this is randomized. Maybe it's not. Man, where am I? Where's explosion? And flash that. Oh! This is gonna be interesting in a non-circular arena. I want Combo Master on. I'd be able to do so much more with it. How'd that not pick something up? Reinstall the stick, man. I don't think I had that installed in the first place. I saw that one, though. But here's the thing about me installing Stickman mods. It has to be the Jedi Academy Stickman mod with the Stickman Sham color palette. It has to be. It's been modded into other games before, like Tony Hawk. That's why you're using Tony Hawk. Why did my controller disconnect? Oh, it's blinking. Still connected. She's running out of battery. She get back on the grind. Yeah, I, I, I still have the server up. Gather. And I fixed the the link because I guess my IP changed for some reason. But the link is fixed, and the server's still running. I need to play on there more often to set an example for the rest of the disciples in the academy. Yeah, let's see what the Pete door is. This would normally be, um, Data's on this in Rando. But I want to see what these Data rooms are if I have access to them. This is going to be a twofer, right? Data stays the same as a normal one? Fuck. Oh! Just a juiced health. What about part two, though? This is a two-part Data. Look, I don't have the setup to kill this guy quickly. I can do it, but it's gonna take a hot minute. Especially with them exploding like this. If only I'd... I... I can do limit, hold on. Let me just get reams real quick. I have once more on, don't I? 
Oh, part two is normal? Okay, then never mind. Right, because final Xemnas isn't randomized, unfortunately. For technical reasons, that sucks. But this is how it, how it be. Alright, what other worlds have we neglected? Let's do a space paranoid. I don't have a single EXP boost. My ability spread in this seat is really weird. It'd be really funny if um, not getting DM skip would crash the game, because it's like, you beat the seed. Technically. Yeah, levels are done. I just want to get as much juice as possible, anyways. Explosion could be on level 44, who knows? Up to 50. I think I'm getting a lot of EXP here, though. Yeah, I'd get better EXP out of uh, some crazy enemy spawn in fucking world than ever was or something. Let's see if it's worth it. It's not even boosted. I got a couple levels. This is still pretty fast. I can use final. Hold on. Oh, here we go. Here we go. That was pretty cool. What does Wisdom Magnet do? Oh yeah, right, it has extra bounciness. Oh yeah, it's got bouncy action. I forget that, I think Master does this too, right? Master Magnet has a bouncy property to it too. video game. Singular video game, and it's this one. I should check down Goofy's abilities. They've been getting stuff, haven't they? It's kind of crazy to think about. They've been getting shit. Wow. Every haste in the game. Oh, I have horizontal slash. That would have been nice to have on way sooner. Can't believe Sham fell out of love with DDS. No way. Get real. It's a slander. In fact, playing Soul Hackers 2 is making me love DDS even more. I'm I'm charging my DDS appreciation meter by playing Soul Hackers 2 before DDS. So that when I play DDS after playing Soul Hackers 2, I'll have a breath of fresh water. You know? Really shouldn't have betrayed us. Cyax? It's, yeah, Cyax? Look, it's Cyax. Look. Gotcha Fucking now. music bar. Where is he? Alright, it's not Data. At least. Clever little sneak. He's in the fucking void. I should have pulled the trigger on that. Oh, this is nice in a big room like this. Can he get me? 
Yeah, I still aim at you, but... You got a lot of fucking room to maneuver, that's for sure. Of course he walks. Of course. Oh, you know what? This is my only opportunity to do this. On this fucking guy. Alright, beat his ass. Oh, he's DMing, of course. We're gonna be here for a while. Oh, you can stop that, nice. Gotcha now! You clever little sneak! Okay! Heads up! Take this! Man, this guy just goes nuts. Phase 2 Zigbar is some of the most aggressive a boss can get in Cage 2, other than fucking Larxene. Even then, she's not even all that aggressive sometimes. Oh, when Larxene gets aggressive. I just do like no damage. Nice. Flash step. Thank God. I like that when he does the second charge shot, he lands on the ground if you're on the ground. There's some swag potential there, I think. Yeah. Yeah, that fight's really weird if you think about, like, developer intentions. Like, what were they cooking? Any data? Any data? Hey, the fourth accessory. Ha. Where am I going? Um, SP two, really? That's a valor form. God damn it. Alright, you know what? Can you block? I was wondering if you could block that spear attack. It probably goes above you. Or over your head or whatever. Oh, this is a good combo setup. Oh, you can block that. Cool. Who is Ringo the Armpit Queen? Show up to Soul Hackers 2 streams and you'll find out. I don't blame my Kingdom Hearts audience for only watching me play Kingdom Hearts. I mean, where else are you going to get this high action, legacy skill gameplay? Swag style content. Nowhere else. watch some other Kingdom Hearts content creator on Twitch do a 36 hour speed run. Or you could watch me do some funny shit in case do random.
Oh. Yo, Wizpun. Put this up. Thank you very much. Let's go. I should have double negative combo on for final form shenanigans. Actually, hold on. We're putting on my favorite combo setup. Negative combos and a shitload of finishers. My favorite form of form combo setup. Having night keeping it classy. Yeah, unfortunately we had to skip Borderlands Sunday this week just because uh, the gang was busy, I could use a day off, SHIB was raiding. But it will return this Sunday. Best day of the week. It'd be cool if there was some kind of like MP lifesteal ability so that like, well this would be overpowered as fucking data is, but like, say that there is an ability that gave you MP for killing enemies in final form, it'd be cool if you could get to a point in Endgame Cage 2 where like, you're killing enemies so fast, you're getting a bunch of MP back, you don't even have to stop the ether. That'd be cool. Out of my way. Did we get everything? Alright, two cures here. I want to see what the boss is. Yeah, I'll try fucking around with more of the. Ooh! There he is! Where, where, where am I? Okay. I'll try fucking around with the other um, enemy and boss rando settings on different streams of this. Maybe next week I'll do another one of these. Are there any KH1 rando heads in here that would be willing to test something for me? I posted it in the Kingdom Hearts channel earlier. This one, okay, this fight's normal. Um, I made a seed setting that eliminates 100 acre wood 
Damn. It eliminates 100 acre wood and um, Atlantica checks. So that you never get a seed that has that be a place you have to go to. You got Frisbeed. Ouch. Alright, I'll be right back. I have to go to the bathroom. I haven't gotten up in three hours. I will be right back. I am back. Ha! Bunch of worlds I haven't even stepped foot into. Let's do those. I think KH1 Sora would actually own in this game. Assuming, only assuming that certain things are gonna be like one to one in terms of like, say, like KH1 Sora's damage output, his peak damage output with kind of crits and all that, and his hits per minute that he can deal with the land canceling and his advanced spells would actually keep him alive in this game, if he were like one-to-one -one pasted into this game somehow. I think he would do just fine. But that's only assuming some things would carry over one-to-one. -one. In this uh, hypothetical.
wisdom shot actually dealing damage? Yeah, it would definitely be harder, but I think he... I think a good player like me would, um... Do just fine. Oblivy. Good to see you. I've been great. Hope you are well as well. You excited for Overwatch 2 coming out in October? Is that a new Twitch account? Didn't you have to like swap out your accounts here? Let me add you up. There you go. I know I'm gonna do at least one comp stream of that. Like day one or whatever. So I'll hit you up for that. I wanna get a I wanna get a I wanna put together a team for that stream. That'd be fun. If it's good, stream that a couple more times. I don't know. We'll see. We don't know how likely that's gonna be, but I'd like to at least pretend for like a day or two. I owe it that much. Stimulus back. Fire element. If Genji is good in Overwatch 2, if he's top tier in Overwatch 2, then that means Overwatch is good. That's the litmus test. Yeah, I still have to go to Halloween Town and fucking Beast Castle 2 has something. Oh, Bastion, probably core. Okay, that got erotic. What the fuck? I wasn't expecting that. Look at the fucking all the nobodies, wow. Jeez Louise. Wasn't Genji bottom tier for a while? Like actually, like did they manage to fuck the game up that bad to the point where Genji became bottom tier for like a long time? Like genuinely like bottom? He had a 3% pick rate? Yeah, I remember seeing like statistics that like backed it up and I was like, what the fuck? What do they do to this game in my absence? Fucking clowns. I guess he was good in the... like the beta for 2 then, right? I can work for that. How do I not have limit for him yet? He's auto-buffed because there isn't two tanks. Yeah, that, that's probably why he was bad, right? Fucking Overwatch became all about tanking and healing like nothing else. So naturally all like the top fragging heroes just were reduced to atoms. They reworked Genji? Like Riot and Earth's Champs? They reworked Genji? How so? What do you mean? When I think rework, I think... Symmetra rework. They didn't rework Genji? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. They, they wouldn't do that. I mean, damage numbers? Okay. You used the word rework too lightly. I get you. 
I'm thinking like Symmetra getting like a second and a third alt all of a sudden. Well, the cool thing is that he runs faster. There's like a, a global buff to all DPS. I think that was a cool change. Remember when um, they made Lucio have passive self-healing on top of him having his self-heal mode? That was a pretty funny beta for Overwatch 2. Where he couldn't fucking kill him because he just had like two fucking heals at once on himself. They removed the DPS feed passive. Well, that was a cool change that doesn't exist anymore. That's cool. That's neat. They should give that to Genji and nobody else. It was not balanced. Maybe they should have tried balancing it, like nerfing fucking Soldier 76's sprint speed. When do we see the alpha weapon? We'll get, um, I think that's on, like, Master Form. We'll get that soon enough. This is gonna be a blackout seed. So that means we're gonna get everything. You need to add Mermaid Kick Ursula 1 to the re replace rewards list. Did I miss that one? Thank you very much, by the way. We're pointing that out. Is there any chance you could do that for me while I'm streaming? Just as you have access to the, the file. Could you just like add that and then post it back in the channel? Thank you very much, by the way. I'm glad somebody actually tested that when I asked. I'm I'm helping Asa set up KH1 Rando. He's gonna do one of those for September. Shoutouts to Asa, by the way. Alright. What kind of boss are we getting here? It's fucking Zemnus. Alright. Which version? Oh, do I wanna... I'm nilled? The whole fight? Okay, well... Race against the clock. You see me hit that one frame final form extension twice in a row? Getting away with murder. What is this? There we go. Fucking A. Hey, finishing leap. That was weird. Is this world done? Nice. Thank God. I didn't want to go back. Um, I'm deathly curious to see what's in core today. A track SC, oh yeah. Item boost? Double item boost, sheesh. What the fuck? Oh, to see that. Yeah, there's there's a mod for the world symbols in the the garden. I just haven't applied it. Oh yeah, to, to further explain what I was saying about fucking extending final form. Um, this is like, mo most, mostly like a tool assisted thing. You can see it in the, the tool assisted data or level 1 speedrun. But if you continue your attacks, like frame perfectly in a form, you can extend them indefinitely. And I think I did it like once or twice there in that combo, because I was out of drive and it kept going. Also, I just got master. Which is nice because I have this now. Yo, damage drive. That's a really good keyboard. Get this dookie ass keyboard off of final form. Now we have this. Ha! 
It no longer makes Oathkeeper noises. Thank you, Fred, for fixing that. You should look into giving it KH1 Ultima noises. That'd be sick. How do I not do Magnet Burst? I just want to do a single swing. Nice. That's much better than fucking Oathkeeper noises for some reason. I, I really need to look to see if there's a Days Keyblade mod, because I was pretty sure I saw people with fucking the open cage set up before that had mods like that. I don't know. Yeah, these- no, these are mods. Um, in the original game, there are- there's an unused Keyblade that has this model. It's called Detection Saber. But Rando integrates them into the game by, uh, giving them to- giving the unused Keyblades in the game to you when you, um, obtain forms, because, like, the- the rationale behind that was... In Rando, like, if you start with a form or two, it'll have no Keyblade and it would crash the game. Yo! Oh shit! I almost forgot I had that fucking alert. I got flashbangs by my own fucking alert. Yo. Hey Z, excellent. Clearing out the whatever Sonic game it was today, Deathstream. Thank you very much. I hope it went well. What's up, Oomfies? We're clearing out a uh, boss enemy randomizer on the newest update for Cage 2 Rando. Give me strength. Rah, Freeze. 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 Fire. Fire. Yeah. Hey, Who is that guy? Alright, core time. When a parent tells you no, you gotta respect that, but Drake just... Okay. Oh, jeez. Our gift sound... Our gift subs discounted. It doesn't show for me. Are they discounted? I don't even think they are in September. I think it's just only like resubs. It's really weird. Damn it. Oh, nice. I made it. I need to find the original post of that fucking Walter video. There's an SMT Portugal feature. Can I make it? With level 4 glide and like nothing else? No. I gotta revert. Walter. Put your dick away, Walter. I'm not having sex with you right now, Walter. What a good show. Anyways, thank you for the follows, all the people who came from the raid. I appreciate that. Free. How's the random artists are going so far? Very well. Free. Free. We got to like Free. level. 40, like, super quick because of, uh, randomized enemies giving us a shitload of EXP. It's really funny when that happens. What kind of changes are in the update? Well, it's more so... The, the update is more so how they made the installation process a billion times easier. 
This has been something that's possible for a long time, but this is done through OpenKH Mod Manager, which like patches the game directly when making seeds instead of doing it all with um, scripts that run in the background. Which gives you more features because, you know, there's a lot that's being patched alongside the scripting that gives you the rando experience, and there are a lot more features that are possible as a result. Like, randomizing bosses and enemies. And the reason why um, I'm finally playing it is because um, what they had before was this three-way setup where you had to get to download the mod manager that only worked for the emulator version of this game and a program that made the mod manager actually work with the PC port. And it was like that for a year, and it was really bad, and like... It was possible to install, but it was like this fucking like seven-page Google Doc that like had a bunch of issues, and I just... I tried to do it like once or twice, and I was like, this sucks. I'm just gonna wait until they like make an actual mo uh, mod manager for PC, and then they did. And it was really easy to set up, and it's great. Hats off to the team. Um, exclamation point rando if you want a link to the Discord to set this up for yourself. They have all the instructions there. Just make sure to follow them properly. Yeah, build from MM. That was the mod manager bridge that made it work. Oh, the fucking trumpets? Not the trumpets. Wait, did my ledge grab have an iframe reflect parry? My, my ledge grab just reflected a projectile and it killed a dude. Do you see that? Somebody clip that. Does ledge grab have deflect pick? Does fucking ledge grab have parry frames? Hold on. I gotta test this. I got so many opportunities here to do it. Ow. Bro, you have got to be kidding me. This fucking game is just too good. It's too good! You can't even do a fucking finisher in Cage 3 without getting hit out of an animation because the finisher's like hyper hammer, don't have iframes. But look at that! Fucking ledge grab flip up has parry frames. I wish opening chests had parry frames. Ooh, but still. God damn, this game. Bitch! My strat for getting through the, um, the turbines is to use a Donald limit once you get this chest. You want final rest chest unrandomized? No, you can keep that one. I like the shenanigans of final rest. Just as long as it's fucking 100 acre in Atlantica or not involved in any cage or rando seed, that'd be great. Yeah, how do these guys like projectiles? Look at this shit. Where's my limit? Oh, I ran out. Oops. Oops. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. This game is so good. Look at that! More fucking parry frames! They thought of everything. I keep doing it. Hey, yeah, I guess it has something to do with uh, aerial dodge. It's like, the, yeah, that. Fucking Ultra Instinct over here. It's like the same concept. Get away from me! That fucking enemy is terrifying. Oh my god, oh no. Oh no. Oh! Please, please. Jeez. Did I get every chest here? I think I missed one. Yeah. Game's so good. All right, I don't think I got anything in core. Did I get everything? I didn't get many items here. Yeah, I got everything. Yeah, nothing in core, that's kind of rare. 
see that very often. No drive. Oh well. The angle is off. Parry frames. Oh no, ledge grab. Why do you unrandomize dark matter? What chest is that supposed to be? Did I fuck something up? I unrandomized all the things that I was under the impression were rewards and chests for um, Atlantica and 100 Acre. What dark matter chest is that? Is it is it a dark matter chest in 100 Acre? Oh my god, it's this guy. You know what? Ooh, fuck. Back off. Oh, you can't magnet him. That would've been funny if he got bounced in the magnet, but he didn't. The way I added all of the unrandomized things to that list is by looking at uh, rewards.txt and chests.txt in the rando files, and I added things that said that they were in 100 Acre and, um, you know. I like to come. I have a drive recovery. I have two. Hold on. Got him. Give me strength. Goofy is fucking dead. I can't believe it. Oh my god, there's so many of them! Oh, the noises. The voices in my head. These guys know all spells. All the shadows here are statues. That's what's happening here. Look at the orbs! There's so many. Oh my god. Swag, the cloud power up. Let's go. Yeah, yeah this will probably be normal because it's fucking thousand wireless boat, you know. Yeah, 
Oh, can I do this? Yeah, it should be high enough. Hold on. There we go. Too bad it doesn't make the funny noise anymore. Settings.txt is supposed to be a .txt, yeah. Uh, and one of the rando updates, they migrated the settings to um, that file instead of it being built into the rando script itself. So no matter what's in like the rando script, your settings will take priority, and it's what's in settings.txt. Ow. Silence. Sudden silence hurts more than loud noises. This fucking port and the way it does that. It gets really quiet sometimes. And yes, you have to be looking at the ground for that. Wow, it actually might be in Sephiroth. Or Tifa's chest, I didn't get Tifa's chest. Or this. Goldwing. Oh, I still get the ground necessary. It's, um... The way that the game spawns enemies is based on your field of view. In that fight. So they spawn enemies where you're not looking in order to maintain the illusion of a thousand heartless. Yeah, that's Tifa's chest right there. Um... So when you look at the ground, everything spawns all around you in the magnet that insta-kills them. So you look at the ground, they all spawn on top of you and insta-die. That's why it's necessary. Ha! Explosion! On Tifa's chest! I love doing that. It's over. But there's something on Sephiroth. Or whatever Sephiroth or the uh, the mushroom is, one of the two. It's called Tifa's chest because Tifa's walking around down there. Yeah, Cage Three Explosion is such a shallow imitation of the real deal. It's, it's funny how BBS Explosion is good in its own way. At least they gave that move swag in that game as a finish command. Alright, moment of truth right here. Ooh, it really is on Sephiroth, huh? Or, you know, whatever the hell Sephiroth is gonna be. Is it really here? Let me just check the journal again. Yeah, I got every treasure. It really is this. What is Cloud doing? Beats me. Fuck. Show me your it's a what? It is Sephiroth. That's enough. <laughs> this is it. All right, this is gonna be interesting. I have an awful combo setup for this. I'll get it. Oh, the off-screen. Did you add super bosses to the pool? I'm pretty sure Sephiroth is down by default. Not that super of a super boss compared to the other ones. Alright, let's do this the normal way. Game, thank God I got an explosion. 
just in time. I had, like, no other proper finishers. Funny how second chance and once more on keyblades today. Give me combo master. Fuck second chance and once more. Give me combo master. That's what I want. Show me your strength. Yeah, Sephiroth feels like he's at like level 50. That's enough. Back off. Back off. <laughs> Do I know a slap shot? I just realized I don't have that. Unfortunate. Is he not level 99? I thought he was. He's not very buff overall. Oh, he almost got me there. That's why, that right there is why I want Combo Master, because he can do that. Honestly, all the datas get smoked at level 99, it's not just him. Maybe not that much damage, though. He's gonna jump. The, fucking, the bounce. Sephiroth can recover in a way that bounces, and if you press X too early or at the wrong time, it'll do a fucking air combo and it fucks up everything. Oh. I think he's like level 80? That does sound about right. All I know is that I'm juiced with my Show damage output. Strength. That's enough. I like getting that explosion or that reflect to actually deal damage. Oh, too early. I haven't played the bouncer, but I know all about why that game sucks. Show me your strength. The game is a cool aesthetic, though. That's enough. Oh, I just realized this is gonna be extra hard because I don't have limit for him. Yeah, give me a. What's better here, second chance or once more? One of the two. Give me a second chance. I, I, I think I still get one-shotted by his combo swing, so it might not even help at all to have it on. What is Show me your I don't even think it's gonna make a difference. That's enough. Take this. This is it. Yeah. Can't believe that guard worked. Oh, but I can't fucking reflect into explosion anymore. No combo master. It's an illegal strategy without it. You have to do that. You fucking knock him out of range and almost die because of that. Oh, my controller disconnected. Controller ran out of battery. Alright, time to use the controller with really bad drift. Give me back my fucking combo master keyboard. Fuck this. Show me your strength. I pressed F for limit, but it was too early. That's enough. Take this. 
I really should do a keyboard run of these games one day. That would actually be funny. When the idea was first presented to me, I, I, I mocked it, but I think now I'm interested in doing that as content. That'd be funny. No, oh, I hate this guy. Fucking three off screens in a row. What happens in KH1 if you plug in a DualShock 1? That's enough. Fucking PS1 controller, does it like not let you play the game like Ape Escape or or what? Is it just something it says on the box art? I was afraid he was gonna hit me on the gun. It gives you a prompt saying, please connect to DualShock 2. Wow, I didn't know that. That's funny. Show me your strength. That's enough. Take this. Back off. I want to do KBM Nocturne. I did... When I played Persona 3, I played it on keyboard. I don't know why I chose to do it that way, but that's how I did Persona 3 on emulator. It was kind of alright, but... I don't know why I did that. I preferred it. I, oh, it was because I played that game at school every now and then. I put the whole fucking emulator on a flash drive and played it like once or twice. Okay. I got a little crazy there. Why did I do that? Man. Show me your strength. That's enough. Why isn't he rando? I don't know. I'm pretty sure this guy's supposed to be rando. Maybe they took that out though, but I want to kill him now. Because he has something. Oh yeah, that'd be good for MF Mondays, fucking do it on keyboard. That's a good idea. This sucks without limit form on demand. He was just reading my mind. Yo, Shagman with the 11, thank you. Why did I not revert? Fuck. Yeah, maybe my seed settings are weird, I don't know. Show me your strength. I'm killing him anyway, so I love killing Sephiroth. That's enough. It's over. Back off. You fucking uh ba ba I tried to reflect in midair this fucking guy. Couldn't do it. Couldn't get through the door, man. Show me your strength. That's enough. This is it. We're stuck. It's over. Back off. No, oh, this fucking guy. That was cool for a second until it wasn't. Show me your strength. That's enough. It's over. Take this. It feels unsafe, but it was safe then. That's enough. Back off. Know your place. Back off. Give in to the dark. 
Oh. No, I think the reason why Donald and Goofy fuck up this fight is because the fight wasn't made to have them in it from the get-go. So putting them in is just gonna make it not work. But I'm sure if they wanted Donald and Goofy to be part of this fight, then they could have made it work. Like every other fight in the game that they're in. Probably just a side effect of them not wanting to do it from the get-go. There's so many unintentional things that fucking works in this game. Thank you, Explosion iframes, for actually saving my life there. He's not getting away with that. Not in my time. Don't mean EMP, man. This is something that Rando has specifically fucked me up in this situation, where Show when you get uppercutted, I don't know if I should press square That's or enough. circle and mash X to hit him out of that. Because it's either I have, like, sometimes I just won't have arrow recovery and I'll have fucking re retaliating slash, and I have to go back and forth between which one is better. Even though they both do the same thing if you react properly, which I never do anymore. What happened? Oh. I locked onto the fucking orb. The more you party in this game, the more you get hit by fucking... The easy stuff, quote-unquote. The more you get hit by the fucking RC, the crazier you get. Trying to party hard and show off, and then you get hit by that fucking attack. Fucking air combo, hate when that happens. I guess I finally remember how to react to that. Ooh, I almost fucked that up real bad. I tried to combo him there. Like a normal combo, not a finisher. But then he started attacking and then I did a finisher and then I was like, oh, okay. How'd you like that? Oh, that was limit for him? Speak of the fucking devil. Did that froth had to limit for him. My message. I updated the cage when random seed settings. Thank you very much for doing that. I was I was certain that I had it right, but I needed to test it. Thank you very much. I was just like control Fing through the rewards page and the chests page and I thought I got everything but I guess there's more all right what worlds do we have left more of Agraba Agraba 2 Beast Castle 2 this is why I didn't want to use this controller by the way this the, I'm not touching the left stick at all you want to know how long ago I got this controller three months ago The stick is perfectly neutral right now. This is my gold DualShock 4 that I just paid $60 for. How do I fix this? Make the dead zone bigger? See, here's the thing. I always do that, but the flicker is so severe that it's flicking all the way to the like the top of the gate. Like it's even putting Sora into like full sprint 
rubbing alcohol, I've been trying. I've been spraying it into the fucking stick and like swishing it around and it hasn't been fixing it permanently. I'll do that now though. Maybe it'll fix it for the rest of the fucking stream. Three of my five controllers have drift. God. Sony's going straight to hell. Okay, well, that should hold. What about Xbox controllers? Yeah, what about them? Nah, they're pretty nice for FPS games that are... For some reason, you're not playing them on the keyboard and mouse, but... They're nice for FPS games. That's about it. <laughs> Samurais. Gather. Back off. Door. Got my ass. Jam just banning somebody and their sub? Not anymore. That's not me. Manuing, by the way. That's not me. Guardian Soul. How many more checks do we have? Like four? Nice. I'm getting hungry. Here it is. <laughs> so many items. I wonder if there's a better button I can put that on to mash it, like, really quickly. Let me, put, let me try putting that on the mouse scroll. I'm curious. You cannot put it on the mouse wheel. Bad. Got it back out. The PC ports are so funny. They really are. It's the thing that makes me feel like I'm living in the future, playing fucking randomized Cage 2 of the PC port. Like, of all the things that makes me feel like I'm living in the future, this is one of them. Like, it's actually so unbelievable that you can do this to me. Like, still. Yeah, the official PC menu for fucking Kingdom Hearts. I remember when we were begging to have this shit on PS4 at 60 FPS. Remember those fucking days? That was real funny. And now look. <laughs> no, so they can focus on KH3? God, what fucking ignorance. <laughs> Every studio that makes a collection like this spends about two dollars on it, and like three people make it, and then it's done.
Square Enix has like 17 fucking studios involved. Oh, we're getting hit. What the fuck? Fun fight. Cool fight. That one really had me uh, sweating and sitting up in my chair. I was real worried. This is one of like the only action RPGs that's still fun when you're like overpowered. In fact, it becomes more fun when you're ridiculously overpowered and you're hitting the damage ceiling. Or the damage nice cap rather. Same word. That's right, away you go. Yeah. I'll walk you flat. That's right, away you go. Nice, that's not a one shot for once. If I were PS2, I wouldn't have gotten hit there. Yeah, I should try doing a C that doesn't have a damage cap. There should be... I wish there was something like that for KH1, Rando. I'd love to see KH1 with a damage cap, because KH1 is like the most egregious damage cap for bosses, like, ever. Alright, time to do second visits. Let's uh, shake it up a little. Let's finish out Beast. Surprise it's not done. A lot of second visits this seed. You more or less get to see what KH1 is like without a damage cap by just, like, dealing critical hits to, like, Traverse Town 4 enemies. Or, you know, critting an invisible with Hurricane Blast and suddenly 80% of one health bar is gone. Imagine that on bosses. Whoa. This is fitting. Gather. <laughs> Ding! Ether. Where do you even go in this world? I'm actually a big fan of the invisible health bar in KH1. I'm actually a huge fan of that concept. The original version of KH1 had more of that. I think uh, Shurnabog had an invisibar. I called it an invisibar because it is. I think one or two more bosses had an invisible bar that you had to chip down without being able to even see the damage. And then they just made it only Sephiroth. It would have been really cool if Yozora had the KH3 version of an Invisibar. I always say this, uh, KH3's version is that it, it displays like a plus one. I think, um, the phone games did this too. But it displays like a plus one next to the mini bars to denote if it's like above the UI cap. And it would have been awesome if KH3 might have Yozora one bar ahead just to pay homage to that concept. But alas. That would have been too base. Somebody make a mod for that. That would be like... It would take two seconds to make that. GBA Com was pretty cool because it had um, some little things that KH1 did. Because it was just imitating KH1. And so it had colored health bars and... Um, Level 100, instead of capping out at 99 like they all do now. Goofy. 
Oh, only two Kingdom Hearts games where you could get to level 100 fucking three digits in KH1 and GBA come. Where's the fun in this? Yeah, and Sora I got um, colored health bars too, if you leveled your health enough. Oh, all my party members got mulched. God damn it. GBA Con was really fun. Playing that. I had more fun playing that than I thought I would on stream. Same with fucking Days. Days was better than I remembered. That's because I went out of my way to like do the best builds. Look at that da RC damage, goddamn. Goodbye. Yo, we got two checks. We got torn pages and a goddamn boofoo. We got that boofoo. In cage, too. Alright, what's left? Halloween Town and Agrabra. Nice. Let's see it. Yeah, that guy had no idea what was coming. Give me Where did these guys even drop? They drop out of EXP, I'll take them. Let's go. As if I need any more of that. Gather. They should re- I've been saying this for a long time. Let me catch you guys up if you're new Gather. to this experience. Um, I've been saying re-days is real for like a year now. Re-days will be real. It's like the most popular fucking Kingdom Hearts side story ever. It's old enough to the point where it's more than justified. I'm going the wrong way. Um, it could be a PS4 and Switch game and PS5 by extension. Yeah, re-58 over 2. And here's the kicker. Do I have a command for this that links to the cutscene in Remind where Riku in his robotic voice is saying, Roxas and Shion are investigating their own memories to find clues about Sora. It's literally written in the game that Re-Days will be real with new content. Yeah, these guys are on the ground, what the fuck? Can we get much higher? So high. Yeah, read days will be real. It's just a matter of when. I'm just surprised that they announced Cage 4 before announcing read days. How do I do the rare combo modifier? Yo, look at this guy. Root Ravager? Hold on. RCs and this fucking on the carpet? Hold on. I gotta investigate this. Get this guy out of here. Hold on. Buddy, you okay? Yeah. Oh man, what's wrong with me? I wanted him to do an RC. Got my ass. It's a rare combo modifier for the carpet. It's like a up diagonal.
Oh, I see. How does this game work as well as it does? Like, that's the worst that's gonna happen while I do a fucking reaction command on the carpet is I just get stuck in an airborne state and it still works? How does this game work the way it does? This game is so open-ended on how it was made that it... was, like, built for fucking being randomized. It's unbelievable. Dodge rolls rocks as well. That's, that one's understandable. The fact that everything else works as Roxas is even more fucking groundbreaking, honestly. There are definitely T poses in this game, but that's like when you're fucking around a different character slots. Really? Daze does have very creative and powerful spells, it's just that... The biggest thing about Daze isn't even that the Keyblades suck, well most of them do, but like... Towards the end of the game, I don't know what gear it's called, but it's the gear that is specialized for critical hits. It has a two-hit two air combo and some whatever ground combo, but it deals so much damage with the right like sight units applied onto it that it actually becomes stronger than magic at the end of the game. That and fucking... The crits you get out of um, your limit break. Also, we just got the magnet. I can leave, thank god. Alright, time for fire in Halloween Town 2, and then we move. Night in Kingdom Key Plus. There is something before that that you can get. It's whatever Twilight Blaze is called in terms of uh, gear. Kingdom Key Plus is the endgame keyblade, but there's something before it that you get that's just as good. Or, you know, it's worse, but you get it sooner. No! <laughs> Down there, right fight. above me. Ooh. so good. I think every chest, I should check for that first. We got the orbs, what the fuck? So many orbs were generated by that, that's kind of crazy. You made me mad. Can you believe that that's the game where you can play as fucking every organization character and Don Goofy, Sora, Chion? And Mickey Mouse and Riku. What the fuck? Remake that game. Give it multiplayer and everything. Remake the whole fucking thing. I wonder what 2013 1.5 Osaka remake of uh, 1.5 would have been like if they decided to actually make it. They just gotta get hand back to remake that game. Oh yeah, that, I forgot, this is an important part of the day's remake copium, is that hand is gonna do it. And it's gonna play just like Cage 2 And have Cage 2 graphics, because that's what they do for the side games now. Oh nice, that is fire, you're right. We have everything. Except for the pure blood keyblade. I don't know how to see the spoiler log. Let me see if I can. I want to find that keyblade. How do I see the spoiler log? Where do I go for that in this fucking new shit? Isn't it in the mod folder? 
There it is. It's an HTML document. Oh my god, look at this. Hold on, I'm getting this on screen. This is insanely based. Look at this. Wow. This is the coolest shit ever. Yo, cat! Just in time for my bitrate to start tanking. Thank you very much for the raid. Okay, it's back now. This is the spoiler log for the Cage 2 seed that the game generates. Look at this. Thank you, cat, for the raid. I hope your stream went well. What, uh, what shitty Sonic game was it today? <laughs> How do I find this? How do I just search everything? I just do you, um... Door item placement? Search her. It's in throne room. I could do that real quick, I think. Sonic Heroes again, Sag. Oh, I hope it went well. Let's go get that key, bud. Let's see if we can do, um... Oh no, it's too late for Sean, you skip. That's the first visit thing. I just gotta do the world normally up until the point. I've seen pure blood, I just haven't like swung it or gotten it. Is there a texture mod or something the game looks extra good to me right now? Um I'm trying to think, not really. Some keyblades are different, but that's about it. Also, my controller is drifting out of hand. Check this shit out. See if I can, like, get it right in the right spot where it goes crazy. Here we go. Behold, this is my new DualShock 4 that I got like two months ago. I'm not touching this stick at all, by the way. It's... yeah, I don't know. It, it was real bad earlier, it like sustained that for like a minute. Why my PC controllers are wired? Oh no, that's not a wireless. That's not a wireless thing. That's just the stick being bad on a hardware level. I should look at the third-party controllers. Maybe there's one that I would like as much as a DualShock 4. I, unlikely though, DualShock 4 is perfect for how I hold fucking controllers. I claw grip them on both sides. So I've got index fingers on the D-pad if I need them, and index fingers and my thumb on the face buttons. It's great. I can menu in this game with my left finger, my left index finger. Oh my god! Look at these enemies. Get out of here. Fuck. Oh my god! Alright, here we go. Walter. Put your dick away, Walter. I'm not having sex with you right now, Walter. Oh, did I get it? I did. Combo boost! Yo! What keyblade does this replace? Does it replace anything, or did they just, like, find a way to add a new item? 
a combo boost. And a cool trail. What sounds does it make? I'm gonna go to core. Oh yeah, anti-form dummy, you're right. What the fuck? It is anti-form sounds. Hold on, fuck this music, one second. Yeah, it is anti-form. It's a, a keyblade, that's cool. Sounds like a fucked up Donald Quack. It's like chain smoker Donald Duck right there. Yeah, I'm gonna use it against them this fucking- I'll give up Combo Master for it. Do I want to give up Combo Master for it though? Hmm, man, I love Combo Master here. The music slider is PC exclusive. It doesn't even mute the fucking audio when you put it down to the minimum. It sucks. Fuck it, I'll use it against them this. We ball. Seventy-two fucking magic in final form. That's funny. Do I have any mega elixirs and all that? I need that for dome scope. There we go. I don't need them, but it's preferred. Just to. So I'm model as you turn the music to zero. There's a bunch of them, like refix, but that's like a whole ass exe that might fuck with a rando more than I would like it to even risk. I don't know if it does, but I don't care to find out. Ow. Shout out to Kaishu for having magic boost? Ugh. It did not need that. Spells did not need that in that game. They didn't need him all that, but they gave him that anyways. That would be cool if Ultima had that, and that was the only way you could get it, which is a single magic boost on Ultima. That would be cool. But, you'd probably, especially at that point in the game, you would be hitting the magic cap, so it wouldn't do much either. Or the, no, the damage cap. Probably. I, I think I remember I w uh, something that I wish Ultima had, instead of... Estega. I'm trying to think of an ability that would actually be befitting for how hard it is to get that Keyblade. Oh, the effects are so cool. Do you see that? Horizontal slash is so cool. The first to run out of time is the loser. Yeah, actually, yeah, master combo boost, both air and ground. What the fuck? Where am I? What, what's happening? Why is the... Oh, okay. I just, I just blanked out. Alright, you're gonna regret that. You fuck. Yeah, so there's some weird HUD stuff with um, new Rando now. Like, first of all, why is it in Japanese? And second of all, why is it the PS2 texture? <laughs> the first to run out of time is the loser. A challenge is 
There's a bunch of like PS2 textures when it comes to like the UI stuff. I don't know how those got into this version of Randall, but I guess it did. It's funny, the reason why it's offset is because the original game is 4x3. That must be why. We gotta do all this. Fucking A. I love when I have high enough strength to insta kill the cards just by finishing leaping. Finish leaping. Finish leaping leap. Whatever. The DM is probably gonna look really cool. Look, it's Goofy, he's on top of the game. The cards are under the floor, you see that? Riku's here. Do you know the rules? He's trying. Is he moving the cards? Look, look at the background. He's moving the cards around. It's a physical object. Also, why did I fuck that up? Oops. Just too distracted by Riku fucking up the environment. This game is so cool. Oh. <laughs> oh shit! All the boys are coming to kill me all at once at the end of the game. I wonder if this is a data version. It's not. I like that they got rid of the ship so that this would work properly. I remember on PS2 Rando, they would spawn really far down in the ship. Like you'd spawn in the ship and you'd have to like fall down. But they they made this like actually work. I remember getting fucking lingering will showing up here and I had to fight him in midair and I would die every time. It was pretty funny. But this is really sick. Also, this is the final randomized boss. Also, we're really high in the air because of that. Oh, fuck. That set us back to, like, the middle axis point of the, of the arena, which is really high up. Hmm. Like, he's so far away now. This is so cool. What the fuck? This is, like, Dissidia. This is just Duo Decium right now. You motherfucker. Get back here. Is that all you got? This is like somebody's Kingdom Hearts fanfic right here. Oh, and then Marusha came back all of a sudden. Oh my god. See if you can keep up with this. Wait. Uh, he's right behind me, isn't he? Alright, you know what. I'm not letting you get away with that. You motherfucker. How many times did I teach you this lesson? What are you doing? Oh man.
Oh, jeez. <laughs> I think the attacks are, like, spawning really high up there, so I don't know. That's why I'm not getting hit. His flower trails are like glowing in this arena. Do you see that? There's like bloom here on his effects. You see that? Maybe it's because I'm not used to seeing it on a dark background. But this looks cooler than normal. Oh god. Fucking drive by. Oh man. Where are you? I want to do his RC. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> I can get him here though. You know what? We're going to go full anime with this. Freak out of my way. <laughs> Is that all you got? <laughs> There's the thumbnail for the VOD, right there. Perfect. Alright, unfortunately this guy is still good old data Zemnis. They can't replace this for whatever reason. Oh. Anger and hate are supreme. Really? I think it's because, like, they would spawn out of bounds or some out of bounds shit might happen. I don't know. Anger That's what people were saying earlier. I don't know. Supreme. Ow. Dome? Oh, yeah, maybe it's dome. I don't know. But they deleted dome. Or at least they made it possible to skip. Supreme. I don't know. What were they put in Zemus's place? Anyone. Perhaps even a randomized choice. No, no, no. Way too early. Is that all you got? Here. Oh, he's up there. Oh, that was a limit. Oops. Why don't you? Let's go. No thanks. Why Doing this at the wrong time. Here we go. That's how you do it. How do I stop the timer? Oh, okay. Whatever. Uh, for, uh, who- I shouldn't even use a timer anymore. What good is a timer? I've seen, I think I remember Bloody Biscuits in a tournament back when there were like tournaments for this shit. Um, 
I remember he did that, but he had Berserk Charge on, and he did like a Berserk Charge Infinite on him to, to seal the deal. It was pretty cool. I'll get him. Hell yeah, that was fun. I'm gonna have to do more of these in the future. How can you say that? Probably I'll do another one next week. Or maybe I'll do KH1 again next week. I wanna do... Just like once a week I'll do a KH stream. It's SMT September right now. But I uh... Who the fuck? That. Speaking of Digital Devil Saga, we'll be playing that after Stalkers 2 is done. So make sure to tune in for that. Yo! Who dis? Who the fuck just cast a Dekaja on my stream? Thank you, Gamer Hill Man. For the bits. Alrighty. That was fun. I'm glad that I can finally do that on the PC version. I think the last time I did a boss enemy rando in KH2 was back in the emulator days. Like, unironically. Alright gamers, that is it for me. I'm out of here. I'll toss you guys over to Asa. He's doing his old school RuneScape thing. What is this screen? Wow. Where'd that background come from? What? Huh? Where's my background? What is that? That's my Soul Hacker's Ditra layout. Why is that there? Hold on. What? You see that? The background. It got replaced? Oh, it's part of the slideshow? I think I put the wrong file in the... Oh yeah, I put the wrong file in the fucking thing. That's why. Oh, there we go. There we go. That's the first time that happened in like 12 streams. Alright, well, at least I know. I will see you guys maybe tomorrow with more Selectors 2, depending on if I feel like streaming or not. Which is, you know, never a constant thing. So, like, let's just say 50% chance. Fuck it. Go hang out with Asa. I will see you guys maybe tomorrow.